Is it the Jake fight? Is that the only time you would fight again? I'd mm. slap him in the face. If I was to come back into boxing, my new thing would be no judging. They saw me kissing a dude. What happened with the whole Coffeezilla thing? Or can you not talk about it? I think it was on Logan's podcast. I said that. I cried. I'm literally over the side, man. Like, I, <laughs> we know. I can't be bothered. <laughs> Yo, what's up, guys? And welcome back to the What's Good podcast. It might look a little bit different because this is our brand new set. Woo! Let's go. And of course, welcome KSI. Yo, what's Woo! up? What's up? What's up? Well, you have to start off with a bang, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again, we asked Harry, but he was busy, so. Well, I'm very impressed. Really? It looks phenomenal. I mean, I think the last time we did a podcast was, what, two years ago? Apparently, yeah. we checked before. I'm surprised it, it was, was two years. It was two I'm years. gobsmacked. And yeah, you kept saying, like, oh, you've been here before. And I was like, no, I've never been <laughs> That's crazy. to this room. And it's just, yeah, wow. Do yeah. you know that the main motivation behind this podcast is him just trying to preview rum? Well, no, and you, by the way. I, can, I, can, I, can, I don't even remember. You bring it up all the time. I bring it up a lot. Because, yeah, so we did the podcast. And remember, we never you were on quite early on when yes. we started. Like episode like four. Yeah, and we used to film. You dissed Kudeka. <laughs> wow. That yeah. was then. Yeah. Oh, my God. We the top floor even, of the second house. Fucking hell. We didn't do guests back then, but we had you on. Yeah. Uh, obviously, um, <laughs> yeah, and we only used to film like once every three months, mm. and we were all like, "Oh, we've got to film soon. We've got to do a new podcast." Da, da, da. And then you were like, "Oh, I bet you won't get past like episode 11 And you were quite aggressive with it, and you said, "Oh, you guys <laughs> always fail. You guys never do this." And then obviously, him being him, you're quite competitive too. You were you. It's actually you were the leading force at, at that point. You were. It, I don't we, even remember him saying this. I'll be honest. No, I think do. I do vaguely remember. And then after, from that point on, we would not miss a week. From last, last week, week. Last week. <laughs> but we said we i was getting fed up of like doing bad podcasts so i was like let's not do one for a week to get the whole set ready and by the way we wouldn't have it would have been an awful episode yeah so i'm glad we did that um mm. and yeah here we are now well i mean i've seen a few tiktoks on people uh slating you guys for yeah, but we not like, trying on this podcast i mean that's kind of the charm of the podcast you <laughs> <Yeah>. know <laughs> the charm is we're so bad that we're good but not anymore <laughs> not anymore we, no, by the way i will say people joke about us being bad but if you actually go on youtube and look at the like we've pulled massive views by the way oh yeah back in mm. the day like five mil five mil five mil two mil one mil, yeah, one mil. Yeah. we've had loads on one mil the thing is the podcast is like an hour and a half whatever you can take 30 seconds where there's not that much being said just put that up and it looks like the worst podcast in the world yeah <laughs> yeah so, it's very true wow you go, most viewed look, look yeah, at this. you're fourth bro yeah and, been, uh, and sixth and you, sixth <laughs> you even have a tv as well that TV, shows all of this? Yeah. yeah yeah you've got like a team mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah. show the team show the team on the, Yo, on the deck <laughs> you can just show, you can actually show the team <laughs> yeah. yeah. incredible no, it's sick. Yeah, we've leveled um, up. We have leveled up. So now I'm taking on like the, I'm no more the podcast bad, podcast good now, you know? Okay, so it's now what's good. Yeah, what, what is good? The podcast is good. Okay, before it was just what's bad. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Well, we still little, little iPads now. <laughs> Simon and I can look at topics while we're, talk, while we're talking, you know? Yeah. Well, it's like Sidemen, you know? This year we keep saying we've been cooking. Yes. Turn the narrative round. But fuck me, man. It's, uh, it's a lot of work. <laughs> Yeah. It is a lot of work, and I feel like a lot of our fans aren't appreciating how much effort we're putting into these fucking videos. <laughs> no, but videos. there's one guy on Twitter who every week says the exact same thing. He goes, whatever the title is, he goes, I can't believe Simon are doing, Simon are doing this in 2024. Okay. It's the same tweet every single time, and it keeps getting, keeps going like kind of viral on Twitter. And mm. in the replies, people say, you've said this every week, and he's like, yeah, no, it's just banner. So the, the one that, the tweet, uh, the tweet that keeps going around, the tweet that keeps going around saying you guys are falling off is just one guy trolling. Yeah, yeah. And you've been putting bangers out this year. Yeah, and the channel yeah. show for it. And actually, I, I will say the one that kind of was a bit stinky was your video. <laughs> we were yes, get that like, trust yeah, me, just that... reminds me every week. I think <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that I produced a stinker. But look, either way, this year we have been just smashing it out of the you park. Have. So many videos that are just doing so well. Uh, just destroying Bayer Squad, showing that we are the the real squad. <laughs> do, do you think that's actually a real rivalry? Uh, maybe a little. Mm-hmm. I think the fan base has made Mate, it a little yeah. rivalry. Friendly rivalry, though. Yeah, yeah. It's not like there's any like, anger between us. No, of course, we don't, there's of no hate. Yeah, of course. We just, you know, we're competitive. And yeah, we've been doing this you know, for what, 10 plus years? So to show that we're still on top, yeah, it's nice to constantly destroy them view-wise. <laughs> to see how his whole expression changes when yeah. he does it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah we're I, doing really well. And it's nice to completely destroy them. <laughs> I, this is what I like about JJ, though. He's actually honest when he talks about like competitiveness. Because I feel like people these days online are so sheepish about it. Like They talk about competitors as if they don't exist. Where I think this is the music aspect. Like You listen to yeah. a lot of music, a lot of rap beef. And rappers don't give a fuck. They all just call people, people out. Mm. Whereas in YouTube, I think people can be very two-faced. You know, Online, they're like, yeah, I love this. On and then offline, like fuck this person you know yeah but like 
He obviously doesn't care that much about the competitiveness. Otherwise, he wouldn't have gone on Bates. Of course, no. no I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not saying he cares. I'm saying he's open about the parts that he does care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is yeah, good. Yeah. People, people got to be keep it real. And at that point, it's about, you know, you know, competing against each other like playfully rather than actually having a problem. Mm. If you actually have a problem, you tend to be quieter and don't say things. I, I feel yeah, like. no, if I actually hate you, I normally say... <laughs> I don't publicly say yeah, it. You're actually yeah. nicer to them. Yeah. Well, uh, no. <laughs> Just in, like to their face and then you're like away. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. Like if I meet you, I'm there like it's on smoke. So like with me and Aiden, I'd mm. slap him in the face. Okay. Yeah? yeah? Yeah, yeah, I'd slap him. What? What's like... Bro, just this don't piece, get me fucking this started. Piece, Has anything like not... happened other than the boxing stuff? It's, Obviously, it's all started from the boxing just stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so like that's even to the point where I don't even want to go and kick now because of mm. Aiden. I don't want to be associated with that platform or anything to do with him. I just think he's a bit of a dickhead. Like, yes, you know, the competition's good. He's got his own boxing thing going on. Happy days. You're like, we're not there to, like, disturb that. We're just doing our thing as well. But when you've got, <sighs> allegedly, yeah. his fan base um, doxing our event and making it, you know, mm-hmm. slowing it down for two years, mm-hmm. two years, two two hours, uh, making people have to leave the venue, having police come in, having to check around to see if there's a b- yeah. actually in there. Do you reckon that the, uh, the, the the beef started with Aiden or was it Dean? Um, it definitely did start from Dean and then from there, it kind of just this whole chaos. Yeah, because I feel like your reaction to that as well was sort of a reason why Aiden got angry. Like Misfits reaction, not just yours, sorry. Well, I mean, with Dean, he's he kind of just... He kind of tried to get out of his contract Yeah. when there's a reason why the contract was in place. Mm-hmm. He's there trying to f- make a fight happen when he shouldn't be doing that. And then Aiden kind of just got involved and just tried steering the pot. Sure. And then obviously, you know, was like, oh, we're going to have this. Uh, we're going to do an event at the same time Misfits are doing an event yeah, yeah, and yeah. show that we can get more views. Mm-hmm. By the way, we still got more views. Okay. Like, obviously, he could. you can see his views, whereas our views are behind the paywall. Mm-hmm. So first of all, ours are more valuable. Second of all, you know, we just got more anyway. Okay. Well, everyone just screenshots the... Your prelims were on kick, right? Yes. And obviously his had more than the prelims. Oh, yeah, on yeah, yeah. On kick. The kickoffs. The kickoffs, yeah. The kickoffs, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. And, like, obviously he's going to win that. Like, that's where he posts all his content. That's yeah. where he streams, etc. So, happy days, whatever. And then from then, you know, I think just, especially after what happened with Mrs. 13, yeah, but it just put a sour taste in my mouth. I was mm. watching it. I was just vexed the mm. whole time. Mm. Like, yeah, when we got docs, I was like, cool, whatever. Like, this is just going to get more people watching our, uh, yeah. our event. But then, you know, obviously when Most Wanted didn't want to fight as well yeah. and ruin the main event... That really, that really That's pissed me off. Blow. Was Aiden that involved really in that? Because he, he came out most wanted after saying he wasn't. So most what is is saying that he wasn't involved and that you know he he just actually got the nerves got the better of him, mm. and that there's a clip. Uh, I'm sure you can get it up. There's a clip where most wanted is in I think a space with Aiden and Aiden's there like yo I'll pay you to not All right. uh, come out of the main event yeah yeah so even, yeah. Though he, even though he's saying he didn't pay him in that moment it had already been spoken about before yeah he's been spoken okay. about before okay. so now everyone's instantly thinking oh it's that well now it's sus yeah, yeah. so it's super sus it's super weird don't like it but yeah um, yeah I'm just not keen on Aiden man mm. yeah uh, fine. I and thinking- the thing, and, sorry and the thing is like He's a type of, I feel like he's the type of guy that can say all this shit, but then in person, he'd be like, yo, what's up, man? How we doing? And I, I, Yeah, nah, and do you think man. that's him playing the game of like, just streaming, causing controversy to like get more views? Or do you think he actually just doesn't rate you and doesn't, and wants to escalate things? Um, sometimes people just play the game, right? Like, no, nah, I think, I think he's definitely playing the game. And I think he also just thinks he, uh, I think he feel, feels like he's the boss. Okay. Like he's a boss because of the whole kick thing. Mm. Like he, he feels like, yeah, you know no one can chat to me. I have fucking billions in this kick. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I from what I've heard, he has like a tiny ass percentage. Yeah. But still, like, you know, he feels like he's the, he's got a big dick because of it. Got so you, you. whatever, let him roam around with his little cock. Uh-huh. Yeah, trying to think he's a big dog. But like, it's, yeah. it's a different level. 
What about Aiden on Misfits? I've heard like people mentioning that. Is that ever going to be a thing? Surely would you, he, would you put surely, him on there? Yeah, but surely no. he's not doing that. He ain't ever. But he wouldn't. He, would, yeah, nah, uh-huh. he would never. He yeah. would never. You'd give him that platform. He wouldn't. Bro, he wouldn't fight anyone. Literally, most people would slap him up. Mm. He'd, yeah. I reckon he'd fight Neon. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I, I think Neon tried to make the fight happen and then Aiden said, no, nah, I'm not. I'm After not all this it. stuff. But then I feel like he, his excuse would be like, oh, Neon's not big enough, da, 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 da. And it's just like, all right, cool, whatever. Where did Neon come from, man? Because I feel like he was not like not anywhere, then he's just everywhere. Like, how does that even work? It's just the, I think it's just the whole thing of doing public streams. He's like yeah. an in- industry plan, stream version. No, no, so. no, it's just the more the more viral you go, the more clips you can make. Sure. The more the bigger you get, essentially. Sure. That's kinda I feel like what it is these days. Yeah. When it comes to making it. Yeah. If you can go viral the all the time. Like Speed is just a perfect example of how to mm-hmm. go viral. He's just so good at it. And um I think Jinxie is another person that's yeah. like getting better at like going viral, like yeah, I'm starting to see a lot of his clips, you know. Queso as well, right? He's a part of that generation. Is that Who, sorry? Queso, Queso. Who? What is that, the biggest streamer? Yeah, I've seen a ton of him as well. Who? Yeah, Google him. K-A-C, sorry, C-A-S-E-O-H. Queso. He's like, he's like the second. I'm not, wait. Like, Case O H. Hmm? Bro, I'm not gonna lie. I've all, I've seen that written a bunch of times, and always thought it was like a phone case brand. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's like the second after Jinx. He's like the second biggest switch around. Yeah, that. I, I'm really? gonna need to see this because I went I'm... on uh, Jinx's podcast. Three point three point three mil followers, all in the past. Like he does TikTok clip. I saw him on TikTok. I was gonna say there's not gonna be much. Yeah, he's not like clips. And yeah, stuff yeah, like yeah that. He's... mad. Fair enough. It's crazy. It's just constant people just. Mm-hmm. And him and Coming Jinxie out of nowhere, a... just getting big. Yeah. And then you have to now know who they are. That's <laughs> why I feel bad not knowing them. But at the same time, it's like, there's so many people that, you know, won't know the side men or something like that. Yeah. yeah. It's just like, different worlds. Yeah. The tide, I feel like the tide's changing for us now in terms of that generation. Like, we are definitely not part of this current generation of mm. uh, what's going on. Well, you, you went with um, Speed or Kai and you said, like, I definitely felt older. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I definitely feel like I'm thirty. <laughs> Even when you did that little clip with a uh, neon, like you can tell that like you're just a different age now. Yeah, you know, like, yeah. why are you speaking so fast? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I, I, I definitely feel like, especially someone like me, because yeah. I live under a rock. If I know who you are, you're big. Yeah. So okay, sure. that case, so you gotta work harder, bro. I'm sorry. Oh, damn. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, yeah. Although speaking of that, you're you said you're watching Ray William Johnson now. One of your most yeah, yeah, yeah. Ray William. So he posts like random YouTube videos on like on people who Long have form. done crazy stuff. Uh, I, just not, not, it's like medium form, so like four or five minutes, but framed as horizontal. Uh, yeah, yeah. Wow, I see all this stuff on TikTok and Instagram. Yeah, yeah. Wow, I feel really old now. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Does it horizontal? What? And it's all, it's all just AI, like, images. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's, all, it's really interesting. Like, me, me, and my, uh, me and Keith. Oh, yeah. 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 We'll, speak about, we'll speak about Keith in a little bit. Uh, me and Keith uh, always, like, watch it, you know, especially at night, just, to, you know, before we sleep. So, yeah, just to figure out, like, what's going on in the world. And I'm happy, though, because I, like, He's a good storyteller, man. He's good for a reason. Like, he yeah. was always good back in the day. You never watched him, right? Yeah, it was before me. Equals three, man. Yeah, and for some reason, he was on the top of the game. The biggest YouTuber, right? Mm. Most subs, biggest views, and he just decided to stop. Yeah. And I think he he was part of the era where everyone thought YouTube was a small thing. So it yeah. wasn't, wasn't going to last. So everyone back then started leaving and going to do other things. So he to left be all mainstream. the hosts. Yeah, he yeah. got all the hosts to do his show, and like his, he was the reason why his show was good. Yeah. Trying to leave your show, man. Yeah, whereas now, I'd say, you know, if you're a top YouTuber, you're pretty much mainstream. Yeah. Everyone is trying to be a YouTuber. Now they're trying to go back or a streamer. Yeah. And yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. Well, even, I feel like Logan tried to leave, right? He he was one of the ones that we always thought he, he was going to leave. Yeah. I don't want to be a YouTuber. I want to be the biggest entertainer in yeah. the world. Yeah, and now he's kind of like having doing both, you know? Yeah. Uh, WWE is still big. No, no, but I'm saying I don't, I, I don't even look at Logan as a YouTuber. True. Like, he does what, he has a podcast on YouTube, but I don't. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. not... He's not doing. I know. I guess he's still posting on YouTube. So it, not much, though. Like, yeah, you were a big uh, like component in staying true to YouTube. Yeah, I mean, I don't post enough on my uh, second channel. Second yeah, but you're channel also now. posting Sidemen videos. But yeah, non-stop. yeah. So yeah, I guess that technically mm, still makes true. me a YouTuber. So yeah. wait, so what about second channel? What, what happened there? Uh, I've kind of just taken a little backseat. Yeah, I kind of wanted to just. Well, I told myself at the beginning of this year, I want to just rest. Mm. 
And yeah, it's proving to be a, a lot more difficult than I thought. <laughs> uh, because there's just always something going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. Whether it's Prime, whether it's Sidemen, whether it's you know music, whether it's just whatever. There's always something. So even boxing as well, there's pressures like, oh, yo, we need you to fight. Da, 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 da. So like for me, I'm just there like, just trying to rest. I'm just trying to find... Like, every time I see my calendar that there isn't much going on, it's fantastic. We're talking about COVID, right? And the way he described it was like, you know my calendar? It's just so colourful. And then when COVID was there, it just wasn't colourful. <laughs> well, it was sick. It just, like, there was, like, red, green, blue, all different things that I have to do. And then when COVID hit, white. Yeah. <laughs> and I was like, this is the greatest thing ever. Yeah. Obviously, you know, it, it wasn't great no, because people died, but... It was fantastic for me in terms of like there was so much space and time for me, yeah. which I never normally had. Yeah. If you had a year like sabbatical right now, you could take a year off everything. Yes. What would you actually do? What would I do? Yeah. Oh my God. So one month would just be me at home. Yeah. Just crypto. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. No, crypto. No, no, no. Gaming. Surely, surely pick a game. Yeah, game. You can't put gaming in crypto. Over. What is it to do in crypto? So like, do you I'm, watch the okay, graphs? so I'm bro, I'm looking at graphs. I slap the graph up. Wait, so when you're at home, yes. you're just looking at graphs. So I've got my graphs up. I've got um Twitter up. Uh so KSI crypto yeah, yeah. and then I've also got Overwatch up. Or depending on whatever game Hold I've on, got. You're playing Overwatch. Playing Overwatch. You don't have, that's okay, not cool, it, is it? Cool. So yeah, that's my crypto. No, that's yeah. not it. That's Wait, that's, no, that that's, isn't. That's definitely not it. No, that is definitely not my crypto. Oh my god! I was gonna say 100 followers. I was like, there's Jesus no way. Jesus Christ! <laughs> nah, this guy's pretending to be me. So I know there was uh, people who were trying to there you go. pretend to be me. Yeah. No, that's not me. Oh my god, that's verified as well. Why is that verified? Oh, no, you can buy it now, can't you? You can buy it. Holy shit! No, it's the oh oh oh, oh that one. That's me. Jesus Christ! Oh, you changed the photo. Yeah, I had to change because I got I saw right. The PNG. Or oh, I, I sold the NFT, sorry. You sold the screenshot. The PNG. Yeah, yeah. You sold the screenshot. <laughs> How much sold the screenshot for? Or is it just undisclosed? Uh, I believe it was uh, 120 sold. I thought you... Well, in money. Solana. Oh, in money, that's about... In English. <laughs> I think it was about 20k. Oh, okay. Damn. How much you buy it for? No, 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 bro. I bought oh. it for something oh. stupid. Can like... you remember my famous one? Remember yes. that? My yeah. 50 cent with Pepe 50 in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Pay seven grand. Now yeah, it's like yeah. no, I, I took a major L. Yeah. With NFTs, major L. And the thing is, I'm going to say this. I <laughs> think NFTs are bullshit and waste of time. But, but. now that, saying this is day one. Now, <laughs> now that I've said this, they're going to stop pumping. And then everyone's <laughs> going to be fucking flying. And, and NFTs are going to just be worth fucking millions again. Not because you said it. No, but, it's just like, because I've said it. Oh, okay. Yeah, you have because power of me, in crypto. people will look at this and go, okay, it's time to pump NFTs. Yeah. So whatever if you do. If they're bad, they must be good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure. sure. So annoying. Okay, Wait. so one month playing Overwatch and crypto. Yeah, yeah. So just looking at crypto. But don't you, trading don't you... as well. I like trading on... Uh, trading. Trading Oh, coins. what, like Forex? Yeah. Um, no, coins. I, no, coins. No, just, as in okay. like crypto oh, coins. I thought it's what crypto is anyway. Yeah. What do you mean crypto and trading? Well, as in like researching crypto. Uh, like, yeah, like, yeah. Cool, yeah. Cool. And do, then do you watch YouTube? I'm doing a bit of TA, technical analysis. And then yeah, I'm there yeah, like, yeah, okay, no, bro, this guy is a wet this, wipe. This is where I need to... <laughs> shut the fuck up, bro. Shut <laughs> the fuck up. <laughs> you don't do TA? And I do not do TA, man. Whoa. I don't what? have time. Yo, what? Do, well, you just randomly buy it whenever. I don't buy you anything. You can buy something at the lowest point. And then sell it at the highest point, and that's how you make profit. I just, I, I just wait until <laughs> Bro, just explain how to make profit to you. <laughs> yeah, I, I know how to make profit. Whereas I also know, you I've just been selling it a lot. <laughs> yeah, I go whatever Twitter goes and whatever the meme is right now. So if everyone's going, oh my god, and actually I didn't, I did nothing, I did nothing, and it went up. So. Well, to be honest, right now uh, I'm not shilling. I don't have any of this coin because fuck meme <laughs> coins. Um, with uh, or what's it? Dog with hat. Oh, I saw everyone in your replies going crazy with you on oh. this. Because you, you said that this is the top. You was like, because they put it on the dome in Vegas, right? Yes. And then everyone in the replies was ha hating on you and they just kept posting this meme. You know? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Bro, I just think it's the most stupid thing. I don't understand why meme coins are not flying right now. I get, it's become a thing now. Yeah, bro. Like, imagine you were one of the people who bought at 0.17. Yeah. Well, I remember back in the day, oh if you had a grand of, of Shiba, yeah. it would 
It'd be worth like a mil at one point. Like way back, way back when. Yeah. And like Doge as well as another one. Like all these fucking meme coins. Can you remember pump, what happened with Doge? I'm, I'm, sorry. But I'm there like, you guys have to be so careful because with these meme coins, once, you know, we're back in a bear market, these meme coins are fucking dying and you're going to lose a shit ton of money mm. and then you're just going to have to hold and wait how many fucking years? Yeah. Compared to, you know, coins of utility, like, you know, Bitcoin, Ethereum, etc. Mm, so much utility out there, isn't there? <laughs> you need to uh, do more TA. Yeah, I need uh, to do more t- No, one, one question. You remember the back in the day, uh, Doge, yeah. do you know what happened? So uh, in, in deep in yes, COVID, you had I Doge, do right? And yep. like, you fell asleep. Yeah. And we were in the chat and it looked like, oh, it's going crazy, it's going crazy. Oh, yeah. And you had made like a million pro- in, in like in pounds, profit, dollars yeah. profit. Yeah. And you were asleep and we were trying to call you and trying yep. to ring you. And then by the time you woke up, it was gone. Yep. It's nuts. <laughs> so you made a million in your sleep and then didn't wake up. And then, yeah. So. What? Yeah. But anyway, like, I That's mean. the most expensive sleep you've ever had. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> Last question about crypto. What happened with the whole CoffeeZilla thing? Or can you not talk about that? Um, I, I can't really talk about it. But ultimately, you know, I think even CoffeeZilla knows that. I wasn't pumping and dumping. Mm-hmm. I wasn't, I'm literally just trading and I was just very into crypto. And I think most people know I'm into crypto. I'm not there like just trying to shit, make a shit ton of money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm in the space. I'm, you know, constantly trying to look for new coins. I'm just trying to push the whole um, ecosystem, et cetera. Well, the way you spoke about it there was like, oh, I want to play Overwatch, relax and do crypto. So it sounds like it's, f- it's fun for you. It's my hobby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I enjoy doing it. Like, say, in do my you, free time. Do you think you'll ever earn more from crypto than you will from Prime? <laughs> no. Or no, so any, of your, any of your endeavors? No, honestly, like crypto is probably like the smallest amount. No, nah, not smallest. But it's not like I'm not making a shit ton yeah. from crypto. I just find it so but, like fascinating. But how... I, I don't. I just get rushed from it. I don't know. It just. I. It excites me. Yeah. And okay. that's fair, like, it's fair. I. I don't know. Like, I guess from the world and like even from you guys and everyone, there, there's a lot of people being like, "Oh, you can't be into crypto." or Crypto's bad, but I'm just there like, but I enjoy it. Yeah, well, our, our, our point just, of view is more but, worried for you, making sure you're okay. Because we, yeah, we, we, yeah. it's like gambling. We don't want you to like fucking lose all your money or no, lose your no. mind. And, like, and that's the thing. Like, I know gambling, and I know what, what my limits are. And I'm there like, oh <laughs> no, I do. But I, I remember being in Vegas with you once, right? And, and I, I bought your... hundred thousand in no, cash. No, well, you did that as well. I was in the suite with you. <laughs> I was in the suite with you and Freezy, right? Yes. And I woke up once. Oh, I came back from a night out. Yes. I woke up or whatever. Went and I saw your door open. Went into your room. It's like yeah. four a.m. Yes. You just weren't there. Yes. And I was. I had to then get up, brush my, brush my teeth, put my clothes on, go all the way downstairs, go through the entire casino, and just yep. saw you sat there gambling like four a.m. Yeah. Get yeah. a massage. Yeah. So I just stayed there. Remember, I was sat with you until I was falling asleep because I would make sure he's not on his own. Yeah, yeah. No, I really. Think. See, my thing <laughs> isn't. My thing isn't even about you losing. Well, it is about you losing money. Yes. But it's more the addiction. Yeah, okay. because yeah. we'll be filming a sidemen video, for example, yes. and we're like, okay, just cut the cameras for two minutes. We'll just need to change batteries. Yeah, get on your phone instantly. Okay, yeah, and you're trading. Yeah. So, so we had the winter holiday video. Yes, yeah. and you turned up to the you swapped to the bad team in a bad yeah. mood, and you were you were very tired. Yes, and I was like, how are you tired? Your day was go in the hot tub, go in the sauna, do all yeah, this. Yeah, and it turns out you were up till four trading. <laughs> uh. Okay, two. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what he said in the morning, by the way. He said four. Okay, okay, okay. but <laughs> but it's true. Like I'm, I'm slowly getting better at like you know improving the whole addiction side of things. <laughs> I think I know. I just get super excited sometimes. So like even bro, even like today, I woke up at like seven something, and I didn't wake up in the middle of the night going, "Oh shit, let me check my." Like I just woke up peacefully. So like I'm slowly getting better. I, you know, not lo- not letting it get, get the better of me. Yeah. Essentially, you do have a very addictive personality. But that's that's that. Yeah, it that's why very I, successful. No, hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. Because but, it makes sense when yeah. you do it when you do it with boxing. You get addicted yeah, yeah, to boxing. Yeah, I was very addicted to boxing. But and that then, is seen as like a like yes, you could lose but then fights. That's, that's like a but, positive thing. Yeah, you know what I mean. Whereas with crypto, if I'm addicted to it, it's yeah. bad. Unless but it you're making, be bad. unless you're, unless everything I'm, is a win. Yeah, yeah. But then with gambling, if I'm addicted to gambling, that's bad. Yeah. Or if I'm addicted to drugs, that's bad. Obviously. So it's, <laughs> yeah. That's that's why. Like that's also one of the reasons why I don't drink. <laughs> Yeah, oh yeah. Because yeah. I used to be super addicted yeah. and then I just fucking go off the rails. So I always said like, like with you, it feels like your senses are just like heightened. 
Like yeah. you never yeah, think, yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah. if you drink a little bit, you, it like, affects you more than everyone else. Yes. And then that goes for One everything strawberry well. daiquiri and he's yeah. gone. Well, <laughs> even, no, even, even with like weed. Yeah, yeah, like, I, bro, I, I remember weed, on and tour and stuff, I'm like fucking bouncing off the walls or I'm just there like super paranoid yeah, and thinking yeah, like I'm yeah. gonna fucking die and yeah, shit. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 God, if you take heroin. Oh, bro, well, honestly, it'd be over, bro. Yeah. That's why it's so like, I'm so glad. Like, I feel like in another life, I would have, I'd be on the floor yeah, yeah. Outside, homeless, just <laughs> with a needle in my arm. Well, that's why I, I talk, when I talk about like what we do and what people do out there, and like in terms of like trying to be something, I feel like us lot are like I don't I don't know what we would have done without doing YouTube and stuff. But but then I feel like we wouldn't have done anything else because like, just whatever we did led us to here because of our personalities. That's why the troops are all good friends because we're all so similar. We're yeah, I feel like, like eventually we would have got to this in place. somewhere. In, yeah. yeah, it might be a different like route, but uh, it would have got there. We asked that on a more Sidemen video. Mm-hmm. We said, "Do you think you'd be as successful in a different career if you'd never started YouTube, bro?" I think so. Like, if I went down the police route that I was heading, yeah, 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 would I have been? Would I have got to like uh, the same percentage in the police force? I think so. As YouTube, I, it sounds very big-headed, Thanks. but I do. Th- well, <laughs> yeah, sorry, but I also meant myself. You know, my oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> but no, 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 you as well. But no, I, I, it feels big-headed. But I think, yeah, even even my relationship with my, with my ex was like, I, I think it fell apart because of how addicted I am to work. Mm. I mean, it, like we, we, me and John spent so much time, and, and everyone else. But me and John were like were sleeping here, we were staying here all the time, and that's what I did with like coming to the Simon house all the time, yeah, all the yeah, trips. Yeah. That's always, that's, I'm always working, and I look back, I think, well, probably did put a not, not enough time into my relationship at times. It's hard to know that then, but you know now. And even setting this up, I would love to be like a podcast producer or like an audio engineer that I was trained. I'd love to do that, you know? And I yeah. feel like my attentiveness to want to do well would leave me there. But well, also it's my failure as well. Well, I think we, you know, as a group, we, we all just constantly work. Yeah, yeah. Like even, like I said, this year I wanted to take a break. It's not a break at all. That's what, that's <laughs> what, when, when he asked what you would do in a month, that's why I'm like, it's yeah. hard to, to believe you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like if you did nothing for a month or you did what you said, you'd get, I feel like you'd have to get bored. No, I think... Or you'd get too caught into crypto. Oh, no, no, no. I think, so like, for me, I'm a type of guy, I rinse it hard, and then I'm all right, on to the next Yeah, thing. me too, man. So that's why, like, with the boxing, I've rinsed the fuck mm-hmm. out of it. But now I'm like, okay, I kind of want to just do something else right now. Yeah. And, you know, same when I was doing music, I rinsed the fuck yeah, out of it. Yeah, yeah. And then I was like, okay, I want to do something else now. And YouTube, I rinsed it. Okay. Like, that's just how I am. And, would you prefer doing all things more, like, spread out, but still well? Or do you like doing, like, getting to the best at one thing and then leaving it? I, know, I, I feel like it kind of works for me. Like, yeah. I, I guess, you know, I'm in the position I'm in today. So I feel like it's yeah. definitely working. You, you don't have to fight on cycles. You can fight and take a break and do music. And even with music, you don't have yeah. to do it all the time. You can release an album yeah. one year and then two years off, you know? So you can make it yeah, work like exactly. that. Yeah, exactly. Um, some things are obviously more often, like me, Simon is just always going, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> well, that's why I feel like sometimes I have periods where I'm like, Oh, I'm I'm literally over the side, man. Like I, we I can't be bothered. <laughs> like yeah, even yeah. like yesterday when I had that <laughs> fucking rant, being like, we're doing too much. We're we're producing too many products. I'm fucking pissed. What the fuck's going on? Ah, uh, <laughs> so yeah, I I know, but I guess I always have all these like tantrums every now and then where I just <laughs> yeah. lose it my all just bubbles up, and then yeah, just, you gotta let it out, and then you're back to the and then I'm yeah. back to. Just you, being me. Do you think losing the fight has put you off boxing at all? Um, I think it pissed me off. Mm. I think to the idea that the judges had so much power. Yeah. I yeah. think at that point, like if I was to come back into boxing, my new thing will be no judges. Mm. As in, not that <laughs> I would. <laughs> Hold on. No. Hold on. No. It, it ends, I won the fight. <laughs> no, 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 no. It ends with someone dies. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> no, as no, in just, like. I, I will make sure that I never leave it to judge. Oh, okay, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I will ne- yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I wouldn't, because that, I think that annoyed me. I just, yeah, I yeah, hate yeah. the idea yeah. that judges have so much power and they can dictate who wins and who loses. I was going to so. say, without, without, like, without a knockout or anything, is boxing not the only sport that is subjective who wins? Well, unless you count, like, referee decisions affecting things. Yeah, but as in like, okay, me and him have a fight. There's no knockouts. There's no minus points. Yeah, so. It yeah. is entirely up to three judges mm-hmm. who wins. 
and yeah. one person yeah. could see punches yeah. from a different angle. It's entirely subjective. Yeah, because even the judges, obviously it might yeah, be more right. obvious. And well, whatever, I'm trying but. to think of different sports, but yeah, it's uh, gymnastics. Because your podcast, your your documentary story is called "Can't Lose." Yes. So are you going to really <laughs> change that or what? <laughs> well, well, well uh, I, it, it was "Can't Lose" back then. Obviously, yeah, things sure, have changed. Sure. So you fucking dickhead. <laughs> What Can't lose documentary apart from be, once. Yeah, what would it be called now? Um, sometimes. Sometimes no. lose. <laughs> <laughs> Can't lose unless judges. Sure. That ain't selling. <laughs> no, 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 I, I, I wouldn't watch that one. Uh, and, and also, if you did fight again, it, it, I would. Well, is it the Jake fight? Is that the only time you would fight again? Um... Uh, I think, you know, Jake fight, the Tommy fight as well. Oh, rematch. Yeah, I, just, I can't rematch. see you fighting anyone else. I feel like there's, I'm, unless something comes out of the woodwork. Nah, they can always beat Mayweather. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, it, even, but it has to be. Yeah, yeah, it has to be top top tier. Um, I know people are like, oh, I want to fight Rooney. I don't want to fight Rooney. <laughs> like, stop. And then people were like. Do you think you win that fight? What? Do you think you win the Rooney fight? <laughs> and then you've got people like <laughs> Ev- Evander Holyfield direction. being like, "Oh, well, no, he hasn't said anything." But people were like, "Oh, because Jake's fine, Mike Tyson, yeah, yeah. and because uh, Evander Holyfield followed me, people think that he's gonna right, want to fight me." Right. I'm not fighting any old man, you know. No offense, but I'm just not doing that. So yeah, where's the, where's the offense though? But they're old. Well, no, yeah. there's, there's, bro, there's gonna be some Jake Paul fan who's gonna be like, oh no, man, he's fighting the greatest of all time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. <laughs> it's Mike Tyson, yeah. even though he's like, <laughs> what if Jake was like, you know what? <laughs> well, Tag sure. team fight, me and Mike Tyson versus no, just, you and Mayweather. Just stop. <laughs> no, no, not doing it. It's just cringe. It's cringe. What? 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 Tag team's cringe or what? No, I, I'm. <laughs> the <laughs> fight, that, he's fighting Mike Tyson. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think yeah. I posted what the rules are as well. Mm. So it's sixteen ounce. Sixteen it's ounce. Not even ten ounce. It's Two minute rounds. Ounce. I just, oh, it's just the fact that they have to change the rules because this guy is almost sixty. Mm. Oh man, it's just so sad. What is the? It was something like anyone over the age of this whatever has to have a EKG and an EEG or something like that. Um, something to do with their brain, like a brain scan. So he might not pass that. He might oh, not. Even if he doesn't, they're gonna try and do They'll just something. Yeah. But then I'm just there, like, bro. What Jay Paul just hits him with a right hand, like a proper right hand, bro. Like, it could be bad for yeah. Mike. Okay, and what- I guess I know. Sorry, I know a lot of people are like it's Mike Tyson, you know, greatest of all time. Blah 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 blah. But it's Mike Tyson when he's. Almost 60, yeah. bro. Mm-hmm. It's very different to a 20-year-old Mike Tyson who would obliterate most heavyweights. I agree. I agree. But then what if, just like devil's advocate, what if uh, Mike Tyson beats Jake? Well, would, then, would, you, would you then say it's embarrassing for Jake? That's extremely embarrassing yeah. for Jake. Yeah. That is, like, laughable. Well, there's no judges as well. Oh, okay. so. well, so, that's, okay. Yeah, so, no, and that's what I mean. So we're not going to know. Well, if, you, if you ask Deji, Deji will say, I mean, he's like, yeah, I've lost. But he'll also say, you know, in the May with the fight. Wasn't that also an exhibition? Yeah, there was no yeah, winner. But... He'll say I won because I'd give him a black eye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, the but thing is, Deji he, lost, it, but it, it, it was a stopped. win. It was a win for Deji. Yeah, for being but he in lost. the ring with him. Yeah. Wait, yeah. what wasn't a win was how long it took for them to actually come out. Oh, yeah. We almost left. Yeah, yeah. It was, yeah it was... Harry didn't even go. I was yeah. jealous. Yeah. We were on a boat. Yeah. Well, to be fair, Harry wasn't capable of going. He was passed true, out. True, yeah, true. yeah. That was the best time on the boat. Yeah, I actually was a little bit mad that I had to go and leave the boat to go watch Deji, but not not because Deji. <laughs> I, w- I wouldn't have been if there wasn't a like a time that we yeah, had to yeah, like, yeah, yeah. an extra three I re- hours. I really wish I got to see the bedroom. Obviously, I don't, I don't imagine. Yeah, I didn't see talk it. about it. Oh no, we can't. Yeah, but yeah, I didn't but, see either. Yeah. Oh, it sounded yeah. nuts. Got you. Yeah. Like, yeah. The whole the whole yacht was. Yeah, there was three hot tubs on the boat. On different floors. Fucking not. How crazy bro. is that? It's not even a boat, bro. No, it's not a boat. Yeah. It, it's actually yeah. disrespectful a to call it a boat. Yacht. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry to that. I went on a boat in Dubai for New Year's. That mm. was so nice. Yeah. I looked at it and went, it does look kind of small now. Yeah, bro. Because <laughs> oh. the boat we went on was so big, everything seems small. It's not fair. Mm. But I'm, that's why I'm super excited to go on the Next jet, trip. the yeah, private yeah, jet yeah, for yeah. Vegas. Yeah. Because that's a jet that I've never seen. 
and I, I've never been jet. before. <laughs> well, it's a yeah. super jet. Well, he goes, in the ch- he goes in the chat to us. He goes, bad news, good news. Bad news is the jet's gone. We can't get it anymore. The good news is we've got this one instead. <laughs> it's like, it's a bigger I've jet. Never, yeah, yeah, but yeah. do you think that's going to change us as well? Like, I'm going to be on EasyJet in like three months thinking, fucking hell. <laughs> 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 I was well, doing no, cartwheels on my last Stay one. humble, stay humble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I was going to ask about that real quick. You know, when you like, uh, you took us to Miami recently, like some of us. Yeah, yeah. Pay for the whole thing, flights, yeah, everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, do you enjoy doing that kind of stuff? Yeah, I mean, I've always been a guy that likes giving. Yeah. And I just, yeah. yeah, like. He loves receiving, so. But- <laughs> Well, I like receiving in a, di- in a different way. But I, no, I was saying I feel really bad. That, like, I was like, because we, like, well, some of us on that trip could have just paid for ourselves. Mm. But, but then also, like, I was talking to Calux and maybe yourself as well. And, and they were going now, but he likes to do that. And if, if I was yeah. in a position, I would also I get, do the same like, as well. I get joy out of yeah, yeah, yeah. And also, yeah. like, I, I guess this is my Christian background. Uh, I'm not a Christian, but as in, like, my parents, like, mm-hmm. the way they brought me up. You're going to get a text later. <laughs> what? <Yeah. laughs> I'm agnostic, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, so the idea of giving, sure. and then you receive from it. To be if fair, you've actually, done, you've actually been amazing at that, because a lot of people in the creative space, if someone's doing yeah. really, really well, they don't give handouts to people to help yes. them, which you've yeah. always done that. It's like, I've always, yeah. And then, but also, it, it does come back to you as well, because... I mean, in, in, even in our well, group, I, I'm just we would like, do everything look at for my, you. Look at where I'm at. Yeah, yeah. Like, look yeah. at how I'm living. Look at just how my life is going. So I feel like, you know, because I've d- given out so much and I've mm, done so mm. much, it's one of the reasons why I'm in this position. So that's yeah. why I keep doing it. Yeah, you know, yeah, sure. yeah, and it helps. And, Some people don't give the handouts and it comes yeah. back to bite them because that person that they didn't help will go and do really, really well and then they yeah. won't have the hand back up to them, you know? Yeah. So what goes, ra- what goes around comes around. Exactly. I've always said that. Nice. What was that? <laughs> it's my favourite saying. My favorite yeah. saying. <laughs> well, uh, speaking of taking L's, as we were talking about boxing. Box uh, <laughs> how is fantasy football going? Because I'm oh. not in this. Well, you know what? It's, it's well, been, I'm not in it, so I'm actually interested. We've actually sure. had like a two week break. And it's felt really good. It's been, qu- no it's stress. been lovely. No, it's and, been and, but you see how you're saying that? You're saying, oh, this two weeks has been amazing. Yeah. So say, say you come, there's 12 of you in the group, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. Say you come eighth. So yeah. you're completely fine from punishment, whatever, okay. like, calm. Would you do next season? Yes. <laughs> I would, because I know says what they hate to improve them. on. I know, so I know just... okay, not to use my free hit in the third yeah. week. Yeah. Or oil your chips. Yeah, yeah. Or, <laughs> let's yeah, let's yeah, put you yeah, oil yeah. chips in the first week. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, there's definitely things that I messed up on. And, like, the amount of hits I've taken, like, I've taken stupid amount of hits. I've and I didn't need to. <laughs> but it's one of the things where I'm like, oh, this player is going to be... Facing Shuffled United in this week, so I have to bring him in. Yeah, and then I'm constantly just doing that. You have every proven week. that sometimes hits do work, though. So you, yeah. if you could take like a minus eight one week or a minus four if you need to, then that could yes. actually pay off. But like twenty eight now, nah, you know, minus twenty eight is just yeah. stupid. And for those who don't know what we're talking about, we're talking about fantasy football. So in the UK, yeah. the Premier League football, you know, you get points if they score and stuff. Sometimes people don't know what FPL is. Yeah. Um, but but what I would also always stay because it, it much, as nice as it was the last two weeks to have a bit of peace and quiet. Mm. When the kickoffs are on, the chat is the best thing in the world. Because it's like literally like a yeah. thousand messages. Someone scores, someone, so people are faking goals as well. Like, oh my God, Werner just scored. Yeah. You know? <laughs> well, it just makes the Premier League even so more enjoyable. Yeah, does, like, yeah. I, I enjoy watching Arsenal. Like before, I wouldn't even watch like Man City play <laughs> yeah. or every Chelsea game. play. Now I'm here watching every single game. <laughs> Especially all the, pl- the players that I have, I'm yeah, watching yeah, their yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. I mean, watching Spurs. Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> come on, Madison. <laughs> <laughs> score. He's, he's celebrating Spurs in the voice. Yeah, what, no, what the fuck's going on? But that's another thing I don't like is like people start just going for some outrageous things. Like you shouldn't ever be supporting Spurs. Yes. But he's, but he's not though, you know. It's no, just, I know, but... I'm just supporting the player. His yeah. idea will be, okay, I've got Madison, right? Yeah. yeah. So my ideal score is Tottenham to lose 6-5 and Madison to get yeah, five yeah, goals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. It's not happening. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I think well, that FPL, it's like gambling. 6-5, <laughs> Madison, like, five goals. It's a safe version of gambling, I think. You know, because you could, you could put like... Well, you say that, but there's literally money on the line. Yes. For us, yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Are you going to be free to go on that trip? Uh, I th- I think okay. I should be. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know, even the chat. Oh, I don't think I can make it, and everyone's like denied. Like you've literally signed a contract. Denied. <laughs> <laughs> it was the only group where you can't rearrange your trips. <laughs> Uh, talking about FPL actually, um, there's a no, nah, no. Nah, what FPL gonna, challenge? I was gonna know. Well, I was gonna mention it. I put it in the chat, being like, "Oh, does anyone want to do FPL challenge?" Instantly, <laughs> ev- just everyone's like. Kill yourself. No, <laughs> shut that? up. Uh, it's, it's a new thing they're bringing in, like another game, uh, rather than, it's like a, each week. So it's not part of your team. You can build a team just for that one week and you get points and stuff on that or something like that, like a game. Yeah. I think, I think, can... I think Will was like, I'll oh, get a job, mate. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's literally like no um, limit. 
so you can just do whatever the fuck you want. Oh, so you just choose the best team you yes, want. Yeah, and I think you can even have as many players as you want. Yeah, in one from one team, and they'll do like double points for players on United and Liverpool or something if it's a set game. Oh really? I thought oh, I saw that. I don't know. I, I don't know. I didn't too look much, into it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's actually. Oh, wow. Leader. You actually yeah. have the. Oh, oh so wow. you so, are lost. You have our names as well. Great. <laughs> Although, lo- you know, the last um, game week, I'm the highest. Yeah, well, by 10. Because you, cause you literally picked a team for that week. Yes. Now, now, all I had to do was take a minus four for, my, for this game week. Yep. Okay. And I still have a lot of these players. I, because Kyle was there thinking, yeah, oh, I'm yeah, going to have yeah, to do yeah, another yeah. minus 28 to get the players yeah, that I want. Yeah, I said that as well. But yeah, I'm not. Fair, fair. No, bro. Like, even with Bassi, he's playing. Is it I Bassi? don't even know who that is. Uh, Fulham. Now, bring up my uh, team again real quick. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Fulham um, defender. Uh, yeah, Bassi. He's playing Sheffield United this week. Nice. And then Forest next week. Bro. You know what I mean? I've, <laughs> I've, I've, I fucking smashed it. Yeah. yeah. By the way, Lux has said, so I don't know if you know this, if J- go back to the league again, he said that if he loses to JJ, he won't play next year. If he comes above JJ, he'll play next year. Who was, there was two people going to quit. It was Ethan, Ethan. and... I think it was Ethan. You I mean, and Lux Ethan. weren't in it, right? No, no. And then because you two joined, Ethan joined. Ethan just stayed. Ethan, yeah. yeah. He's still saying that he's going to quit. Lose, if Ethan loses to you two. Because he went, I'm only staying because I know I can beat these two idiots. Yeah, he, I, I, okay, okay, so he, 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 he could still lose, you know. He can't oh, be, yeah, I still have a triple captain. 100%. Yeah, yeah, I, I think I've got Salah. I think, I think Theo, game week 34 slapped on, bro. Is it double? Double. Oh, god, bro, I think Theo, crazy. Theo and everyone below is that like bottom four. I think that is not in that order, potentially, yeah, yeah. but that's the bottom four. But that'll change. Yeah. This has been changed. Even, even I'm not clear now, I'm still in the conversation. Mm, yeah, anything for the cup. No, we don't do cups. Oh, we don't. We've not even looked. Uh, yeah. Also, looks. Uh, sorry, Ethan. I think Ethan. I don't think he'll leave because I think his weekends are going to be so empty without. Uh, yeah, but FPL. I don't. Yeah. Think he, I don't think Ethan should do FPL. I've never seen like you get angry at it or you get angry at it, whatever. But it's kind of like a you're just pissed about a result. And yeah, you're, yeah, you're yeah he is. He is genuinely. His whole mood pissed. changes. Yeah. But I, his weekend is ruined. Yeah. Yes. You're and ruined I, for like an hour. As a friend of his. I want nothing but the best for him. I don't want him to be upset, but I love it when he gets angry. Even, yeah. the, golf, even the golf channel we're doing, no, I'm so upset that he's not in it anymore because I want him. To, he's like, oh, I was going to get well, raped. he was going to be in it. He was, Bro, it was, was going to be all of us, apart from you, Vic, and Toby, <laughs> which is just the white guys out of the class. <laughs> <laughs> and Ethan's ruined it for us, sorry. <laughs> ruined it? Well, no, well, yes. He's ruined that <laughs> joke. Well, I, it was it was Freezy's birthday, right? Yeah. Freezy's birthday, we played golf. Yeah. And uh, he walks back in. Well, we went on the same team for yeah, we were. Me and no. you. Me, you were yeah. even freezy. Yeah, we, we walked back in and uh, we're the first team back. Yeah. Ethan's team come in next. He walks in, okay. literally just like throws his hat down. He's like, yeah, I'm, I'm done with the sport. I'm done. <laughs> like, I'm giving Josh my clubs. Yeah. And he goes, yeah, I'm going to quit the channel. I don't, I, like, I, I don't want to play this sport anymore. <laughs> Hasn't played, he's played, I thought it, would, it was just a joke. No, he left the group chat. Left, left in, yeah, not, not involved. But I wanted to be because like, he for the channel he would be so good because like no matter what, there's always going to be someone raging. <laughs> 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 and he loves the sport, man. He loves golf. He loves every sport he picks up, though. Yeah, well, like he, he becomes. He's kind of like you, just shorter periods. <laughs> oh, I, thought, I thought you were going to say shorter. I was like, what's well, not very nice? <laughs> no, but like you get addicted to like boxing, music, whatever. Yeah, he does that with. You know, he did that with go karting for a little bit. He's done mm. it with golf. He's now with darts. Like he gets very addicted to a, yeah. a sport, takes it up. Sometimes he's not great at it. Yeah, <laughs> throws yeah, it away. Yeah, yeah I, I feel like with boxing, we haven't really been able to see his true skill. I, so. Who Ethan? Yeah, I think that's just purely because of the Weller. Like, if Weller signed it, he would just be boxing now. Oh, okay, yeah. But, he doesn't have a fight, does he? So no, I, I, I do think he was—he was right in that whole thing, though. I think he like—he has the right to say, you know, I'm worth this, or I'm not going to do it. I think you know? we offered what he wanted. Oh wow! And then okay, well, it still I'm, broke down. So I'm wrong, wrong then, I guess. It is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a little pussy. Essentially, <laughs> Ethan's a pussy. <laughs> he doesn't want to fight Joe. Well. <laughs> oh, speaking of that, real quick, uh-huh. what's going on with you and Josh at the minute? What do you mean? I find there's so much like animosity online. Everyone thinks you hate each other. No, we don't hate each other. Mm. Do you just think he's a dickhead? Yeah, I can't... <laughs> pull it up. There's a video where Josh... Oh, is this because you keep saying stuff like, oh, we're not doing this because of Josh? Yes, yeah, yes, yeah, yes, yeah, yes, okay, yes, 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 yes. 
<laughs> and uh, and also, real quick on Sidemen Beef, you uh, recently said on a sidecast that went quite viral uh, that you don't want to be with Vic anymore on any teams. <laughs> yeah, it's just a joke. It's just a it joke. You, you, can't see, you can't say that about Vic, though. Oh, uh, yeah, he has no. No, the craziest fans, super man. Serious. But I feel like so, a lot of my fans know that I'm joking. Yeah, of course. Most, like, well, your fans, but not his fans. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Most people know that, yeah. But you to clear it up, just to squash the beef, you, you yeah. just meant because you were with him at the same time three in a row, three episodes, three videos in a row. Yeah, yeah, Including yeah, Simon. Yeah. That you were three in a row that you would, you know? Yeah, but... But I couldn't make it. Me and Simon are uh, like real friends. (laughs) (laughs) No, but the thing is, people actually think, I don't know, like with me and Josh, do you think there's actual beef? No, I think you just, I think you just genuinely do disagree on a lot of things. Certain things, yeah. Yeah, that's it. There's no real... It's never actual beef. Yeah, I don't hate him. Of course, of course. It's just, we always disagree. Yeah. Like he says one thing and I'm like, no. Mm, but yeah. it's just because we are both very different people. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So he takes his time and I'm impulsive. <laughs> I'm like, let's go. We need to do this. Let's go. Let's make a move. And he's like, no, no, no. We've got time. But it's like the, sure. the winter holiday, things. for example. Yeah. He was like, oh, maybe we should split this into two parts. And was very much on that. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. it was a three hour video. Yeah. Two, yeah. One and a half. Well, so. and and it, about, it'll but, also give us an extra week. Yeah. Because we're, we're more time. Yeah, we're struggling for you time. Know, we, you know, I'm going on holiday for two weeks. Mm. And then we're all going to Vegas mm-hmm. for a week. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I was like, oh, we need all the time we can get, you know, for uh, two videos. Yeah. <laughs> and also, the, it was three hours, but it would have been longer if it was split in two parts. Anyway. Exactly. Yeah, we, we, got two, two hours. we cut out a lot to make it three hours. Yeah. 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 It could have been, yeah, four. Yeah. 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 Uh, do you think in Vegas we'll end up filming? Hmm, that pause tells me already yes. No, because <laughs> no, 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 I, I don't think so. Because we actually did mention. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were talking about dates to film, and we were like, oh, "Do we have to? Do we have to do one in Vegas?" Yeah. And I remember, like, I was one of the people. I went, "Please, no." Because like, last time um, we did two, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. Normally, I'm quite. Well, that's like, what we did one with Nigga yeah. Higger. Hold on. That's just not- that's just not how you say his name. Uh, what? <laughs> well, can I say that? Say it. Not no, that no, not exactly. That, you can't say it yeah, like exactly. that. <laughs> what, what did nigga Higa? He, he says Higa and says the first part <laughs> <laughs> like that. Oh, okay. Ryan also, that, Higa. Yes. And also, that, that wasn't even that trip. <laughs> no, that was me and you. That was ages ago. He's talking about when we did oh. hide and seek in the house. And calorie challenge. And calorie challenge. Oh, but you yeah. didn't even do, me and you didn't do the calorie, <laughs> calorie challenge. challenge. We did yeah. it in UK. That's the famous time where Lux arrived to the uh, the hide and seek just almost almost dead. Yeah. Yeah. The picture is like him stumped over. He's, <laughs> he's almost dead. I think honestly, he's so close to dying. Because <laughs> we said, by the way, you know this, it's his birthday. It was his birthday. He's yeah. 30th, right? Yeah. And we said, he's like, oh, can I bring my friends to the trip? We said, no. Yeah. <laughs> you can't bring your own friends yeah, to your yeah, yeah, 30th. Yeah, so he decided to fly them a week before. He wanted to take like eight people, right? Mm, yeah. yeah. Trying to get in anywhere with 18 people. Oh, bro. It's impossible. We barely get in with 10. <laughs> I know, yeah. I know. Especially because it's all guys as well. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so um, on seven videos, you keep mentioning Keith. What's, what's going on? Who's, who's Keith? Man? So Keith is my boyfriend. Right, okay. Yeah, that, you know, I've been dating for, I think, six plus years now. Wow. wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. I love so him. So the, the freezy uh, So you're cheating prank. on Keith with me? Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> no, no, no. He's cheating on me with you with Keith. Keith. Yeah, yeah, damn. Yeah. yeah. I'm the OG. So the, the trend was real. What trend? You remember that trend that went on Twitter? Some, some bloke was saying that, you know, KSI is gay. Oh yeah, that they saw me kissing a dude. Yeah, <laughs> crazy man. It's that, was that uh, Keith or was that someone else? Huh? Was that was that, that Keith? That was, was Keith. Keith. Was before. Yeah, that's wow. me kissing. Yeah, nice. Yeah. yeah, nice, nice. Just yeah. Damn. I do love Keith. <laughs> wow. wow, with <laughs> all my heart. I'm serious. Yeah. Um, <laughs> how, how do you feel? I mean, are, you ha- are you happy? Are you in a good place? Or are you just stressed? What in general? Mm-hmm. Um, it's so funny. I was talking to Keith actually yesterday. Uh, <laughs> how I'm a little stressed. Yeah, but I, I think that. that's why Japan has come at a perfect time. Sure, like and my Vegas. holiday and Vegas. Yeah, uh, like I was saying, the pressures of life. Yeah, are starting to annoy me. So mm. I'm there, like, oh, the amount of Simon videos we're put, like recording, it's a lot. Mm. Like you gotta remember, it's not we're not just doing the main channel. We're doing main channel reacts, mm, mm. uh, second channel. Side plus, you know, side plus, and like I've been on every single side plus yeah. this year. I feel <laughs> you know, <laughs> I'm a snitch on Josh here, right? Yeah. So we're going on a golf trip next week, and the day before we have sidecast. Okay. You're not on it. Yeah. Uh, but Josh is. I'm on it as well. Okay. And I was like, oh man, I wish, like, I wish I'd come off that, but I haven't been on one in ages. Yeah. And Josh is like, yeah, I want to come off it. Is JJ free that? 
<laughs> you're, you're not on it. You're not on it. Oh, <laughs> but my. Was, we looked and we were like, J- I did say, Jay has been on like the last like, three. Yeah, bro. Honestly, I need a break. <laughs> and then, so I've got that. So that, and then, you know, obviously I, I was streaming for a little bit, but then I was just like, I just. Too busy as well, right? I'm too busy. I'm just a little stressed as well. I'm not in the right, you know, frame of mind for it. And then, you know, Prime, doing a lot of stuff for Prime. Yeah. You know, I'm traveling low, all over the place, done so much traveling. And then, you know, still having to find time, you know, to chill with Keith as well. Mm-hmm. And then, you know, I've also got, uh, you know, pressures from music and boxing mm. to make things happen and all that. So it's, it's a lot. Yeah. So I'm just there like fucking hell. Like I need a fucking break. And that's why whenever I have days where there's just not much going on or it's just white in the calendar yeah, yeah. it's just so good well why don't, why don't you i know you're doing obviously the two trips you mentioned but you can always like well I'm sorry to this happen you can always just like book a trip and just be like guys i'm busy no i but i can't just bun everything off harry does no, <laughs> no, no, but go, I, go, go I, in the calendar I, and wait until you see like vic away or someone away and just do little ones there because you know no i can't no, but he has something else though. because but, then i've got something else yeah it'll be like, like ethan uh, not ethan uh harry's going to like this golf course in portugal yeah and then he's going to la to do a prime shoot sure yeah sure. so exactly with, with prime is your goal to just sign every single person in the no, top of the no, game no, in every no, sport? just the no, no, the, the greats the greats yeah, in yeah, each top, sport. top yeah. tier yeah yeah i actually have a list of everyone yeah well uh, i have a list of the sportsmen okay oh so all women all women that's pathetic of you sorry <laughs> <laughs> um, pathetic. sorry <laughs> So uh, there may be someone missing, I don't know, but yeah. Patrick Mahomes, uh-huh. so American football. Bro, you got destroyed by him as well. The clip where you got tackled, right? Oh, no, no, Logan, 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 who maybe annihilated even, Maybe me. even worse. Logan's fucking well, beast yeah, bro, he's a unit, man. <laughs> yeah. Well, Patrick Mahomes does, yeah. he's a quarterback, right? Yes. So he doesn't really tackle. No, he, he just throws. Yeah, so I'd actually rather get tackled by him than Logan. Sure, yeah. sure. Alicia Lehman. Yes. Austin Matthews. Yep. Who's he? He is an ice hockey. Wow. Raphael Liao. Yep. Haaland. Yep. So if Liao and Haaland were to play each other, mm-hmm. would, who, which team would you be rooting for? Both. I, like, it's a nine, win-win. Nine. It's a win-win. Triple hat tricks from both of them. That's pretty much what I'd want. You know, our prime Fair athletes enough. doing what they do in their prime. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. Bud Crawford, nice boxer. Yep. Kyle Larson, NASCAR. Yep. Shakur Stevenson, boxing. Yep. Drikus, Dry, Drysus, Duplessis. An MMA? Yep. <laughs> yep, yep. Devin Haney, boxer. Yep. Adesanya, MMA. Yep. And Volkanovski, MMA. Yeah. So if they... Is there a possibility of any of these people fighting each other? Like the boxers? Could... Do you do you sign like one or weight division? Um, I guess you could... Not, not really. We kind of just sign people who are like top tier. So I guess Haney and Shakur Stevenson could fight. Yeah. Um, At some point. But... um. No, literally, the, with Prime, it's always just best of the best. Yeah. That's just who we're going for. I find it funny how you sign Haney, and then like Ryan Garcia's like, oh, Prime's gross. Prime's gross. <laughs> Prime, <laughs> is, <laughs> Prime is um, part of the devil and all this yeah, stupid yeah, shit. Yeah. And the thing is, it's like, first of all, my mom would not let me go you know, onto the dark side <laughs> because she's a, a humongous Christian. <laughs> So the idea of me becoming satanic yeah. is just out the fucking window. Yeah. Like my mum would pour holy war <laughs> <laughs> repeatedly on but me. It says on here ingredients: <laughs> child's blood. Yeah, no, really. <laughs> like it's just like my mum just wouldn't let me. Yeah, it'd just yeah. be long. It'd be yeah. a long fucking Sorry, day. Wait, are you saying the only reason you're not joining the Illuminati is because your mum won't? <laughs> yeah, so, <laughs> so He's like, mom, guys, I've been offered, but yeah. I can't. My mum won't let me. <laughs> if your mum turns around to you tomorrow and goes, "I'm actually agnostic." You're uh, going like, sign oh, me up. Sign me up, bro. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, it, it, speaking of, though, what, it, there's actually, right now, a lot of conspiracies that this stuff has actually happened with the whole Diddy stuff. Um, what, in terms of what? As in, like, the Illuminati, all these higher powers. Oh, I mean, I, look, I never, I mean, I don't know, maybe there is some sort of higher power, but it's like, it's just people who have a shit ton of money. Mm. Isn't that what power is? The yeah, more I, money you have, the more power you have. I think it's less like, Illuminati type stuff and more just people doing fucked up things. Like, yeah. well, like the Diddy thing is kind yeah. of crazy. I, I don't really, I, I, I have no idea what the fuck's going on. I just know he's on the run. Yeah. Or he's like f- flying to Africa. 
Wait, well, supposedly. I mean, for some reason, my Twitter has started to become like okay. just all these conspiracy Oh, you're things. seeing all of this. Yeah, oh, unfortunately. Because everyone keeps saying that their, their Twitter is like always like the craziest stuff happening. Mine's been really, really good. Just like fun stuff, football. And yeah, now it's yeah. started to go a bit, a bit right wing, I think. Really? Uh, yeah, so, <laughs> uh, apparently, they saw his jet like leaving leaving the country. Okay. Going somewhere else where you can't be extradited or whatever it is or whatever. Uh. And then, uh, but it, apparently, it was just his stuff. So his stuff was getting taken over, okay. and then he got pictured in somewhere. I'm just gonna wait for the Netflix doc. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's yeah. I'm just gonna wait for the doc, and then figure out what the fuck's Did going on. Did you see the Logan Paul documentary stuff? Yes. Yeah. So for the thing know... is, because I met that guy, you can say. Oh, but... so he was. In the, he, you've been filming the documentary. Yeah, you've been, been filmed. The, yeah, oh, yeah. Bro, it was on Apple. No, so uh, so well. apparently <laughs> this guy, this documentary journalist, documentary maker, spoke to Logan and his agents, whatever, and apparently it, it was. They were going to shoot a documentary. It was going to be on Apple, like mm. going to premiere on Apple and everything was like set. And I feel like Logan's team's pretty tight, aren't they? On, yes. on that, you know. They're not going to just allow it. To... Yeah. And, and, and somehow now this guy is just waxed on his YouTube channel. Oh, bro. It's, it's got like, like 1,000 eight... views. Yeah. yeah <laughs> views oh, 10,000. Sorry. 10,000 views. 10, I, I shouldn't views. laugh as much my vlog. But, but <laughs> you, we're comparing a Logan Paul documentary to my vlog. <laughs> An Apple TV. Yeah. That yeah. took five months as well. Yeah. Five months. Yeah, and apparently man. Logan had them run on Christmas Day. Yeah, man. Him run on Christmas Day. So that's crazy. So, oh man, yeah, it's I, yeah, I, I don't, I don't really know the ins and out, yeah, but it's it's a shit situation. Yeah, yeah, is it? Wow, thirty uh, one k now, but I mean, well, because Logan's yeah. probably yeah, it's Logan's now. probably talked about it so much that yeah. it's got it views. I, saw I thought yeah, Logan. I, I thought it was gonna be yeah on, on something like was Apple it at least like or did, Netflix or did he did the guy at least think I'm gonna make it and sell it to one of these. And that's what it's going to be. And then they, no one bought so, it anymore. Uh, right. Well, apparently... Or was it just a long prank? Apparently it was going to be on Apple. And then management changed in Apple. And then they said, nah. Right. Uh, okay. And then I don't think the guy told Logan. So maybe he panicked and said, fuck, I got to release this anyway. Yeah. Because I think if he told Logan, then Logan would have been like, you can't release this. Well, but the thing is, if this if that's the case, surely yeah. Logan being you know, as smart as he is, he would have gone, well, let me just post it then. I'll just post it. I'll, I'll pay wallet yeah, or I'll post it on my YouTube channel or something yeah. like that. Yeah, so I think maybe that's annoyed him as well. To be fair, this guy's got 800k subs. Go on his channel. What else does he do? That seems like something really like... Oh, it's just... It's just Logan Paul. What oh the... my god! It's wow! Just... Oh no, it, they're all short. It's he's posted. It's the whole oh. documentary. So yeah, he definitely oh, he he's, definitely he's... is losing money. He needs yeah, to. He's trying get to make. Oh no, wait, he did it on here as well with Barry. Oh yeah, I know Barry. I, I don't know Barry. <laughs> oh, Bert Kreischer. That seems like quite a a mad thing to do when you have like such a big audience, like eight hundred k subs. Yeah, but but then um, but now I'm looking. I'm looking at his channel, and it, it looks like he does this with every cha- everyone. So it looks like his thing is doing a documentary on his own channel. But can we see what his most viewed are? Because I'm there. Like, well, he's I was going to say these ones. A lot of views, and though. Some of them were like two k. The the views are quite ten mil. Okay, ten mil. Ka- and Alvarez. Yeah, they're oh, they're a yeah. long time ago. Steve-O, five years. Alvarez, two years. Shaq, oh, yeah. Eight years. What does it mean? Okay, so this guy. Is it, this guy looks like a nah, reputable. He's washed, bro. Yeah, but he looks like someone who's in the industry doing um, documentaries, though. I, I guess it's just miscommunication with everyone involved. Mm. But but Logan, Logan, and, I mean you and Logan actually working together really well on Prime. You've got like a really good like. Yeah, it was just it just. He always said, by the way, uh, if you guys weren't fighting, you'd be best friends. Yeah, yeah, and there we go. I mean, you know, <laughs> like you're still my best friend. Oh, are you? Oh, but now now you said that, it's as if like we're not. What? That, you don't have to reassure us. Yeah, it seemed like you were no, you guys using, are using copium there. Yeah, like, well, no, I, I, I mean, don't worry, guys. I like I, you. I've known you guys for way longer, obviously. Well, uh, yeah, but yeah, like yeah. me and Logan are good friends. Yeah, like okay. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, no, no, no. Where, our point is now you're saying that makes us think that you've actually thought about that. Do you know what I mean? Like we thought it was unquestionable who you like more. But, but you're, you're, you're going. No, don't worry, guys. I was never worried until now. Yeah, now I'm gonna go home and throw a dart at you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, um, but no, I was gonna say Logan is uh, actually smart, smart guy, isn't he? Like his yeah, yeah. Is... just how his thought process and everything. He's just very articulate as well. Yeah. With everything he says and does. What was what was SmackDown like? The banner scenes. Oh yeah. Oh, it's it's just cool, bro. It's yeah. just cool seeing all these um wrestlers. You, you're actually big into wrestling, right? Yeah. So, it, bro, it was WrestleMania that was yeah. nuts. Yeah. When I, bro, I was just seeing all the wrestlers, bro. Mm. I was, bro. I got to see The Rock. Mm. Uh, practice his entrance mad bro and it's so funny like <laughs> he would walk out this was before everyone's like coming into the stadium he'd walk out 
and he's got people just there, like, you know, making sure he's, like, sick and, you know, feeling good and happy and all of this. And he's just there, like, doing the rock thing. Like, yeah, the rock says. <laughs> to nobody. Um, to no one. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, like, he's making sure that the entrance is, like, yeah. pinnacle. And, like, it's, like, a statement. Mm-hmm. Well, and everything he does, it he, he seems from the outside looking in that he does it to perfection. So he's, yes. he's got very high standards in every aspect and of it's, his life. And it's also crazy to see, like, how big these guys actually are. So with Randy Orton, I've never met him before. But fuck me, bro. Yeah. It's crazy. Like, you see on TV, they're big, but everyone's big. So you aren't yeah. able okay, to yeah, really yeah. compare until you're there bro, in person. Well, it's like the, the, NBA. First, the first time I met Logan, I was mm. like, Logan's fucking massive. Yes. And then he stands next to these lot. Doesn't look big. Yeah, it doesn't look big. No. It's fucked. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Bro, like, and you when I got RKO'd by Randy, bro, he grabbed my head like yeah, it was no, I, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. And just <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's 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 lit. One it thing was I, a sick time. I've not asked, heard about is how he was meant to land. Yeah, you landed wrong, right? I landed yeah. so yeah, wrong. Yeah. So obviously if we had practice. Sure, I would sure. have been able to land probably, but we didn't. Why didn't you? I think it's going to happen, right? Uh, well, I don't know. We just didn't. We had the mat out and everything. Yeah, so I, I heard you went to the ring yeah. and you, everyone was just like chatting and chatting and chatting and then the just time ended. I t- that's <laughs> <laughs> pretty much, yeah. Um, what well, question I had there. What were you saying there? You were what? saying something. What were you actually saying? Aren't you just gonna I was that? like, oh man, Logan, bro, you've done me. You've done me. Yeah, like, okay, cool. Cause it, why I, I are you mean, out here and I'm in here? Yeah, as a, as a, I'm not a fan of wrestling, but I, I like it. I'm not against, yeah, I'm not yeah. a hater of it. But like yeah. at the same time, like you know, you could just left the ring. <laughs> bro, <laughs> it's Logan, no, Logan, no. You could just, like... just asked if he knew he was behind him. No, I know, <laughs> but I'm like, but he did. So just leave the ring. <laughs> yeah, but I was always going to get RKO. No, I know, I know. Yes, uh, that's why I like wrestling. <laughs> it's jokes, but you know how weird it is, like that you. So you just said you were watching The Rock do his entrance, and then yeah. obviously you've come out. Was that as in? In this event. Yes. So ages ago, you interviewed The Rock. Yeah. Yeah, let's pull that off actually. Cause... Like, how weird is that? Yeah, yeah. Well, it's come full circle somewhat. But as in, you uh, He from... probably doesn't even know who the fuck I am. Uh, no, nah. actually, he probably does. He does, yeah. Because of Prime, yeah, yeah he probably yeah, does. Yeah. But like, you've gone from doing like a. a what's it called? When you. They get like time them a promo, yeah. Junket. A junket. Junket. You've, yeah. you've gone from you had probably like six minutes to do a press junket with him. Yeah. To you actually working with him. Yeah. Yeah. That's insane. Like it this is. video is jokes, but I remember he looks back the in... same as well. That's the, that's yeah. the maddest yeah. part. Nine years ago, nine point two mil views. Bro, I was shit myself as well. I was sweating on my armpits oh, and yeah. everything. It was so hot. Who else have you done uh, interviews with? Uh I did one with <laughs> Uh, Ryan Reynolds. Yeah. yeah. That was cringe. That, that was... was... <laughs> when you watch that back... It's because uh, I, I think... It's he's... the headphone era as well, where you're not like... Oh, fuck off. Wearing headphones. Headphone what? era. <laughs> it's because he was like... He was playing a character, but yeah. it did not come off well. Yeah. Did, yeah. He's a smart guy, man. Well, he, had, he also had one that was uh, not Ed. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I appreciate yeah, well, that. We, can, we can't talk about well, that. We're, we're, we're not going to talk about yeah. that. <laughs> but there's, oh, um, the Cohen, Sasha Baron Cohen. Oh, yeah. Oh, my oh, God. I can't, yeah. I can't even. Wow. Yeah. yeah. I forgot about that one. Yeah, no. Wait, I, who was he playing got, then? Um, it wasn't Borat, was it? Oh, Matt Damon oh, as well. Matt Damon. Wait, wasn't this one where you... <laughs> yeah, you fucking made... Matt Damon. Oh, by the way, this one, I swear, shout out to him because he was actually playing with you. Yeah, on, he was like playing the yeah. yeah, yeah, Why yeah. were you wearing that? Uh, it was like just... Because it, it doesn't doing have any, a bit. It doesn't yeah. have anything to do with your character. No, no, no. It's just me doing a bit. <laughs> oh, um, speaking of bits, are you still... Are you still of the opinion that you could do stand up, or is that was that was that all no, a pipe no, dream? No, no, no. At what pipe point did you realize that? I, well, I think when I actually tried it in front of the boys, or no. So I oh did. Oh my god! Um, <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my so god! So I'm so glad I got cancelled at the time <laughs> because then they had to take it down. Okay, but there's actually there used to be recorded footage of me doing stand up. Uh, I think it was for either Buxton or Evian, but it was like a promo for what? them. Do you have yeah. it? No, it's gone. It's deleted. Why is it deleted they, or private? They deleted it. Or well, they got rid of it. No, they posted it. A Buxton. But because oh, okay, then right. I got cancelled for something. Right, right, right. Got you, got you, got you. They deleted it. And thank the Lord. How about? It was it so bad, bro? Was it bad or was it low-key well, offensive? No, it was not. I, I don't even remember. But I remember just doing it. 
and no one laughing okay and just being like fuck you know tough crowd and no one laughing at that as well and i was like okay this is <laughs> this is this is painful because you know he genuinely has a 10-year plan to become a stand-up well i, I feel like you can do it You've yeah got the I'm, look. i've got a right ru- thanks <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean well you know you know you the know Shane like, Gillis look well you what shane gillis pull shane gillis up i don't know who that is yeah i'll show you and tell me what you think this guy looks like well, you know how like all comedians look funny. Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> so I look a little bit funny. Uh, I've no idea who I, he is. No, I don't think you. But have the fact that like, you know him shows that you're serious. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Uh, who else in the troops look like they could be a stand-up based on that? Then who um, funny? he's gonna say nobody. So now I'm just the weird-looking guy in the group. I actually don't think anyone else looks like they could be a stand-up. Oh, Freezy. I think Freezy. I was, I was going to say Freezy. Looks wise. Not, 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 I yeah. think... I don't think looking. I think he could be, but just if I saw them in a room uh, and they all said I'm stand-up, I'd go, really? To every single one. Even you. Thank you. No. But I believe yours the most. Got I, you. I'd say definitely. I'd say Cal Freezy, 100%. I was going to say Calix, but... Uh... I think he could write something well, but the thing is, my problem is delivery. I can't speak. I can't speak. Well, you've I just been stutter. speaking for... Almost an hour. Yeah, now, true. So, <laughs> so I, I, great I think, podcast. So it's when, yeah. when we did our when the video we did yesterday, the M one. Yeah, there's a bit in there where there's like a little stand up thing. Mm. I was petrified, but I think it's because it, it, that, that was harder because there was only five people. I can say that right. Yeah. Only five people, which makes it also weird. Like if there's a hundred, I think it'd be easier if there's a hundred people there. Yeah, because there's more likely you're gonna have one person that laughs, and yeah. then that creates a chain like, reaction. It, yeah, yeah exactly. I preferred it. No, but even if, the fact that there was five, I was like, this is blessed. Yeah, but they go, oh, they go yeah. I'll just say, I'll just say a shitty joke. If there was a whole room, I'd be like, I, I have to go, do a good joke. Did they laugh at you? Yeah. I literally got a pity laugh every single time. Got you, got you. I told two jokes. Yeah. But I also think it's, stand-up's also about preparing for it as well, right? You got to write something. I had nothing prepared. And the one thing, <laughs> what I was going to do, I was going to do my joke from the winter holiday that got cut out, mm. but I thought it was going to be you, like you two people we knew. So when I got up there, it was like 50 year olds. I, like, I can't say what I was going to say there because they were just not even find that funny. Well, have you even attempted to no, no, like... No, no, no. I said you should go do open mics. 10 year yeah. plan, 10 year plan, man. That's that year two. No, nah, but you need well, 10 you years have, of practice. Yeah, you need to start. Sure, sure. Because also, yeah. now he's vlogging every day. Mm. That's a great vlog. It well, is, yeah. yeah. And yeah. it would show your whole progression. Yeah. What, what, oh, yeah. Why not a, like a Simon Sunday? Like everyone has one night to go and do a, a stand up and it cuts between I would. I, I think that would be hilarious. You know, we actually got offered it from Jack Whitehall. <laughs> no way. He okay, was well, like, does anyone want to come up for like two minutes? In one of his shows. Well, one, oh, of, his, one of his shows is a bit hard. Oh, it'd be God. horrible. That'd be the most. Te- that'd be awful. No, I'd, I'd so down. Because you know, so Chris down. MD did it as a forfeit yeah, yeah. for penalties. Stephen yeah. tries did it with him. Oh, oh yeah. really? Well, Stephen tries is a comedian too. Yeah, he's, so, yeah. He's more qualified than, than I guess we are. But he went down the like roast route, whereas, like, I, well, I don't even know where I'd start. I'd freeze. What you talk about your life? Your life, man. You got a funny life. You got a hilarious life. Do I? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's something funny from a life. Um, Your brother's quite funny. Thanks. <laughs> oh, sorry, Johnny. Sorry. <laughs> no, I'm just... Um. Exactly. <laughs> no, no, no. There's something. There's something. Um. Yep. All right. Uh, next topic. Oh uh, shit. <laughs> no. Wait. Shit. Can you remember the time when you did it in front of the boys? Because I keep hearing about this a lot. It was at dinner. Uh, we were in. We're in another no country. Boo. We're in Nobu. Yep. And yeah, he had it on. He just said like, oh yeah, I have a stand-up routine on my phone. Uh, yeah, I tried it. And then <laughs> I, the, the best part of it that got the most laughs was when I said pause for laughter <laughs> by accident. Yeah. And everyone died at that. <laughs> yeah. That's funny. Yeah. That's really funny. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm not doing it anyway. No. Yeah. But no, I okay. feel like with someone like me, I have a funny life. Like I've done yeah. a lot of funny, stupid things. So I can always just talk about that. Yeah. Well, yeah. there's a difference between being funny and also stand up. Stand up's like really hard because, you know, even I, I think I could be funny in like a podcast or a video, but mm. then that's because I know you guys. I also know like what's going to make you laugh or yes. what make you laugh. Whereas when you ran- randomers, I don't, you know, you don't know what's going to make them laugh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, I, I was, was going to go into I completely forgot. And I was hoping I got it back, but I got it back. Can you remember you know, Theo Von? Yes. Like one of the biggest guys, the biggest podcast, one of the biggest podcasts now uh-huh. ever. Um, and we saw him. Remember? We went to the Joe Rogan. Uh, comedy store we actually saw him yeah so joe rogan <laughs> did a, a show yeah we didn't even, i didn't even know joe rogan was gonna be there yeah we went to the comedy store in la at the time we're just there with leon and everyone and we're crowded around a little small table yeah and there's a guy with a mullet who was the funniest guy and that was theo von no way yeah man so i'm always gassed up he's so, holy he's so fucking funny. shit so we saw, saw him early. before he was funny 
Well, no, he was still funny. Well, no, he <laughs> but uh, he might have been known in the comedy world. But because uh, now I listen to a lot of podcast where like they mention all these comedians. What's the same with um, Bad Friends podcast? Is Bobby Lee right? Yeah, Andrew he's, Santino. He's done a movie with him. I've yeah, done yeah, a yeah, movie yeah. With Bobby Lee, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Bobby Lee was so funny in that movie. Man. You guys he reacted so to. You, I think he's. I think he's one like, of the funniest guys. I think that podcast is the funniest podcast. Really? Okay, come on. Me and John, John, we were worried, right? Because we watched you guys react to it. Bro, and I the was... first thing, no, no, but we didn't watch the whole thing. The intro goes, this podcast so washed, man. Huh? There's the a in... clip of you saying this podcast is so washed as like the intro. Back. Intro. Unless you didn't say washed. I, Why well, is it their I... intro? No, no, no. no. In the intro of Simon, Simon, reacts. Simon yeah. reacts intro. They've taken a clip of me saying this podcast is so washed or something. Okay. I think I might have been talking about our own podcast. I didn't we, think this. I actually had a I think it's a clip. Of, right. I think it's a clip of me later on going like this podcast is hilarious. Like, Ours is so washed. Or we could, uh, oh, okay. we, to be fair, this is a point where we should we could we could play it and find out. But your your headphones don't work. No, man, they do. No, oh, wasn't loud Nick's, enough. Nick's taking, Nick's taking yeah, when, when, oh. when Nick's back, we'll have a little look. But um, all yeah, the comments think... are saying that you they're saying that oh, I wish uh, JJ, Harry, and Ethan react to this instead. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I was watching it and it was me, Toby, and Vic. I think so. And the first joke. So happens. the least funny people. Safe. Uh, <laughs> oh! The <Sorry>. uh, <laughs> the first joke happens. It's offensive, obviously. Yeah, yeah. And I kind of like start giggling. Afraid and to I laugh. Hear, no, no, I just hear nothing. Oh. And I'm not, I can't burst out laughing if there's no laughter elsewhere. If really? I, I, I didn't hear Vic once the whole time. <laughs> and because they're, they're probably offensive jokes. Yeah, I was like, these, yeah. these are hilarious. Yeah. I, I, I obviously, I know we aren't comedians like they are, but I would like our podcast to get to one of those kind of levels one day. One of the Bad Friends style, you know. Yeah, I ain't gonna happen. <laughs> it will, man. No, no. I feel like after a period, like I think we're still in a period in the zone where we're still have to be quite careful with what we say and do. Oh I, no, I don't, I don't mean the content. I, I don't mean like uh, the jokes. That you they just say. mean size. I just mean yeah, like a decent size and also oh. a respectable podcast. You know. Oh okay. Well, I mean, you guys are doing a good job yeah. doing bits yeah. right yeah. now. Yeah, I mean, this is the start. This is yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, the camera is very good. Like yeah. honestly, this is on par, if not better. Then sidecars. No, this that is bad. This is yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah. Al- Although, just that one thing that we thought we had a little panic about that uh, side man. Oh, you know they asked the side men set. <laughs> yes, it's a very it's like the same blue with the same flooring. <laughs> TV there, oh, two sofas. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And this we, feels way better than last. Yeah, it does feel. We didn't mean it to happen either. He was like, uh, mm, the grade looks a bit sidecasty. <laughs> we were like, fuck. And we looked at the blue, and I'm like, the blue's the same. Oh shit! Yeah, but it is. we've been going. We've been going longer than that. Yeah. And by the way, John and I literally, we, we were surprised. When this set got built, mm. we were like, thank God, because we winged this whole thing. We, we AI'd this set. Oh, and really? It showed the builders the AI, and somehow it turned out really nice. Holy sh. Wait, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, AI is getting too crazy. Yeah. I think I saw a thread. Uh, I think I. The girl doing the little promo. Yes. But you know that's really con- controversial right now. Why? Because two AI companies have come out saying that they made it. Which okay. Obviously, how can that be true? Yeah. And also, someone found her on Fiverr. And uh, they found that she's doing, she just does videos. So the girl's real. Oh, so oh. the girl is real. But, 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 but I, I'm, I don't know the story. Oh. Maybe you can Google this. So there's, there's an AI girl. Someone went on, on viral on Twitter by saying, I paid those money to get this AI model made. And it's someone yeah. doing like a social media influencer, like selling makeup or whatever. And it looks very fake. Her eyes are like really weird. It seems off. And that was AI. And two companies came out and said that we made it. No, no, we made it, you know. And then someone found that girl on Fiverr. So she, she, I think what happened is she does exist. She is real. But they modeled the AI model off of her because there are so many videos available of her. Okay. So, yeah, I don't know if you can find that. but There's a lot of people going viral right now for like putting a video of themselves up and saying, oh, can you believe this is AI? <laughs> yeah, bro. That's like... Well, that's what I saw a picture of Diddy getting arrested. Yeah. And then all the comments are like, it's AI. Yeah. And then yeah. I looked at the picture and his eyes are literally like touching. Got you. They're like this, yeah. like literally. Uh, right how can I send this thread? Oh. Uh, um, do you have Nick's number I'll or John's it. number? Or John's. Uh, let me... Yeah, mine. Go for mine. But yeah, no, AI, that's the scary part of AI. Because people keep going, oh, AI's getting really scary. And then everyone's like, no, I can tell it's AI. But it's, it's, it's the comparison between how it was last year. Remember that Will Smith video? Yes. Him eating spaghetti. Oh, and then now yeah. he's like, you know. Now it's just like, just, it's, it's, it's hard to tell. I feel like if you're a boomer, you'll be able to, no, if you're a boomer, you're there like, you have no, you have no you chance. You can't even tell. Oh, yeah. Even I'm starting yeah. to get duped a bit on uh, TikTok videos. There's this one where this guy was ringing a doorbell and they were arguing okay. about how many black bins each, each person's got. He's like, oh, you can't have two black bins. It's against the law. I've called the council. And I was like, oh my God, sent it to a friend. And he was like, mate, that's fake. 
<laughs> and I'm, and I'm, I feel like I'm pretty good uh, at knowing what's real or not, you know. Even Josh in the chat was having a go at me, you know, about things that were fake. So I'm losing my touch. Fuck it out. I'm becoming man. old. You but become... as, as I was saying to him, though, the one good thing about a podcast is that you can get old on it. Because yeah. probably at least like 52. Fuck, I didn't I know that's up. his age. Oh. And also the Andrew Santino guy is actually really underrated. He's so funny. He's so he used funny. to write roasts. Yeah, he's so funny. Yeah. That was one of the clips ah. that literally met, like, made me... Oh, I was laughing so much. Is, have you seen the one where it's like, it's Father's Day or something like that? And it, he's, he says to Bobby Lee, he's like, now I know your dad's dead, but mine's not. <laughs> <laughs> he does the he best just, accents as well. He just starts laughing at him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This so, is AI. This is AI. But the problem is with these ones is that they're so obviously AI because they're obviously... Barack How Obama. can you tell okay, that's well, obviously to... AI? No, no, no. But this is one of those ones where it's Unmute? like you watch it out of nowhere. You wouldn't believe it's AI. I'm also a deep fake. And you should take care when you watch a video on the internet. See you soon. Some people are okay. losing their minds because the video. So you can kind of tell that's AI. It's a bit robotic. Yeah. And also, depending on what he says, like you can't, but, really, make, you can't really make him say something outrageous. because You know he's not going to say that. Outrageous okay. Thing. But like Trump would... visually. Yeah. Without, if you didn't hear the audio, yeah, yeah, you would think that's real. Yeah, I, 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 okay, sure. I sure. think you could post that. You could post that with like, I don't know. If I think if a reliable source posted that, you mm-hmm. wouldn't think it's AI. Yeah, but then I think it's just you where you see it, you think yeah. it's AI. Hang on, which elements are you guys thinking is AI though? Because some of the AI models will just do like the mouth movements. Yeah, and stuff. they don't do the whole, the, not that whole. Yeah, I'd assume that was the just AI. the mouth. Yeah, I'd assume they've taken another interview he's done, yeah. changed the mouth and the vo- uh, the words. Yeah. What? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Can you? I couldn't believe when he came out for the UFC. Like, I've never heard Whoa. like a chant or cheer that big. Like, oh he was like, "Bro, god. obviously, I don't, I don't like him or whatever." But he was a boss. Yeah, bro. the way he walked, bro. Honestly, like, because like when you see things like that on wrestling, right? Everyone's, you know, but that was real. Like he was real, and the crowd was real. He walked out like a wrestler. He Who's w- the guy who runs the wrestling? Like, what's his name? You know the Vince McMahon. McMahon. yeah. He, it felt like that. Like yeah. Trump starts walking out, and the crowd were going crazy before we saw who it was. I'm like, "Who's this? Who's this?" I'm like, "What the fuck?" I thought it was like Conor McGregor or yeah. something like that. And again, I do not like Trump. But it was the most badass thing I've ever seen in my <laughs> it, life. Nah, it was nuts, and it, it makes you think. Oh, he's just he's gonna come back into. Uh, he's gonna be the president. Well, yeah, not to get too political, but I, th- I, I, I know, not, but I think he's won over so many people there. Because they all the like the right wing people. There's so many right wing in America, you know. They look, they love all this. It's because yeah. Dana White, him and Dana White are best friends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so I think that's why, like, he is like seen as a god in the UFC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy. Sense. Yeah, I, I, but I don't see him as a god at all. He's just a man to me. <laughs> I'm not a fan of Donald Trump. Okay, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> um, we mentioned Sidemen earlier. Mm. Uh, this weekend that just happened was. This one yes. is Easter weekend. We did a very festive video. Oh, yeah. Do you know what our video was? It was no. a fashion show. Oh, yeah. I heard this was weird. <laughs> and we all portrayed death. Oh, God. It's it, it's it's super, super weird. So, <laughs> so that... Uh, you, you, what did you do? We, we, split into two, we split into four teams of two. Yeah. We all got given a theme. Yeah. And you had, to, you had an hour to plan your outfit, an hour to find your outfit in this big warehouse of yeah. various things. Yeah. And then we had to do a catwalk in front of about 40 okay. people Who was the guest? in your teams. So he went with George Clarkey. Nice. I was with Ethan. Uh, Josh was with Arthur. And then Vic was with Harry. Is which one? Which one? Who's missing? Simon? Toby. 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 Got, oh, yeah, we got you. Got you. Our themes were... My, well, well, yeah. You had... Medieval. Medieval. We had Gangster. Oh, Medieval. That's kind of like the Red Alert. Yeah, Did yeah, yeah. Ready? Okay, Gangster. I can see uh, that. I can see that. Arthur and Josh had famous dead people. Okay. And Vic and Harry had crime. Okay. So I think the one thing I thought was like, okay, crime and gangster uh, uh, go hand in hand, yeah, very yeah. similar. similar actually, yeah. But we went for the route of like, all right, we'll go like Italian gangster, like mob Ooh, boss. Yeah. Ooh, the so, Godfather style. Yeah. So okay. Ethan was the Godfather and I was a snitch. So I was in a wheelbarrow. He wheeled me out and dumped the body. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. So I'm dead. Right. Oh, yeah, see, I see. So then we this had... Is like part of the fashion show. Quite yeah. fashion you know? Yeah. Quite outside the box. I mean, Ethan, Ethan looked good. Yeah, he did, did look did, very did good. Did you not? Oh, I was dead, so I literally had like a black eye. I had a bullet wound. Okay, okay. Yeah. I was covered in dirt. What were you wearing, though? I was wearing a, a, a very a bad show. suit. It's not, it's not like a I look make, like I, sh- show. I belong in Shoreditch. <laughs> well. Uh, Vic and Harry were Jack the Ripper. 
yeah. and uh, a prostitute he had killed. Mm. Vic was the prostitute. Uh, so again, another death. Yeah. JJ and Clarky were the Black Death yeah. and the Plague Doctor. <laughs> so there's part of me that thinks when this goes out, some people are going to think that me being the Black Death is racist. <laughs> yeah. Which makes no sense because it killed Europeans, first of all. <laughs> so it had nothing to do with like Wait, Africans. Go, okay. Also, like it also like killed bare Europeans and it just I don't know. I, I just feel like some people are gonna think that it's somehow racist, me being it's the black, it's death. black death. But that's, that's, it's like it's got nothing to do with like no, black I know, but like, I know, I know. Yeah. Just part of me thought, oh, some people are gonna try and make this like a thing, yeah, yeah, and try and get me cancelled over it. But it's like no, like even especially with how I'm dressed. But I'm there, like I have to look like yeah. I'm deaf, as if I'm <laughs> like I'm on death's door. Yeah, like boils so I've got like boils okay, on okay, me okay, on my nice. legs. But some people are gonna think it's something to do with like I don't know slave trade or some stupid shit like that. So I don't know. I'm just saying this, yep. just in case yep. someone tries to make it racist. Yeah, it's you're not racist. actually racist. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> because the black death has nothing to do with black people. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. And then uh, Josh and Arthur were uh, Henry VIII and Queen Elizabeth. Yes. The first, I think. Which one was which? Josh was Queen Elizabeth. Wow. And it's he actually went full on really wig. Makeup, yeah. dry, a dr- big dress. Yeah. Yes. So is that why it was weird? Because I feel like, well, theirs was obviously portraying the Black Death. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And they had a, a like a choreographed fight scene. Yeah. yeah. Where he dies. Yes. Josh and Arthur were dead people. Mm-hmm. We had a dead person, and Vic had a dead person, but none of them were planned together. Wow, okay, yeah, okay, we didn't plan you. to be no. based around death. Um, but when we organised the video, we all talked about how we thought, like, oh yeah, you know, one team could have the theme C. Like as in the ocean, yeah, and they could he dress up as like a dolphin, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The themes so, were all just like I wanted to be an elephant when I first, when <laughs> no, we that's first racist. started. Oh yeah, fair. You're right. You're right. <laughs> I, 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 I'm just again joking. <laughs> but but then yeah, medieval. We're like, well, I mean, elephants and medieval don't really work. No. So <laughs> it sounds like a Vic video. Was it a Vic video? It was Vic and Josh? No, no I'm, I'm joking. I knew I knew it was a Vic video. Oh. I just put him in it. Um, you think it's gonna do well? I don't know. By by halfway through the day, it felt like the wor- one of the worst videos we had done. Yeah. <laughs> like it felt like Winter Olympics. Okay. But then it gets really, really good. Yeah. Nice, nice. nice. Yeah, the second half felt like, like one of the best videos. Yeah. Okay, like sick, Harry, sick. <laughs> Harry and Vic's walkout. <laughs> Hilarious. Okay. I, I mean, you watch it and you understand why. Did Harry yeah. put, uh, did he go for like the strut? In his warm up. In his practice one. His practice warm. His practice walk was probably yeah, two minutes. I'd say yeah. the whole walk out poses back. Yeah. Hilarious. Yeah. The actual walk was about sixteen seconds. Okay, he yeah. sprinted. Whoa. And you gotta remember, he's yeeting Vic as well, like <laughs> by the arm. Okay, okay. Sprints down, holding Vic. It's so oh. funny. He just panicked, man. Yeah, lovely, lovely. Do you, oh. you guys think the uh, video ended up the energy picked up because of Maxine? Yeah, yeah, hundred yes. percent. Yeah, Maxine was the person who was like helping us. Um, the catwalk do professional. The catwalk. Yeah, mm-hmm. okay. And she was incredible. Yeah, she just gave us new life. Were you the first team to do? No. Was it Harry and Vic? I think it was Harry and Vic. Harry we were and after Vic. you. Yeah. So yeah, so I think the fact that Harry went up and was like, "I'm Jack the Ripper," yeah, and I'm going to be dragging him as a prostitute. Mm-hmm. I th- as soon as she heard that, she went, "Okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I get the vibe." Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So, hopefully that's a good video. Yeah, well, going back earlier, we are having this discussion about the videos this year being bangers, mm. and obviously your one not being. Do you want to know a fun fact? Yeah. It's the least viewed Sidemen Sunday ever that's not a montage. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, pull it up. Because like, that's impressive. Uh, <laughs> I don't include clubs, podcasts, montages, or like book tour. Sure, sure. So what what, what went wrong, man? Because you like go popular. What do you mean? What went wrong? Five point one. Well, you know what? If you one of the worst views videos been on five point one, and scroll that. all the way, just keep scrolling while we yeah yeah. So what were you gonna ask about? It? Well, yeah. What went wrong, man? Like because because you you this came at a time by the way where you were like I cannot fail because you'll hype the video. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's just the reception wasn't well like good. Yeah. So look, so this is all podcast YouTube originals and stuff like that. Charity match, and, and then it's go. there. <laughs> it's only just more than our announcement. Winter Olympics. Who was that? That was Vic. 
Okay. Deal or no okay. deal. I think Ethan. it will be Winter Olympics. Five years, one month. <laughs> okay, for you, you've got five years to catch up. Yeah, no, you're not. He's not wrong. Wait, we got no. The video, by the way, is getting no views. How? How? how like, but we're always 2000, talking about it being the worst video. Two thousand a day. Two thousand a day, and we've got five years. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. But yeah, I, it wasn't there two kids. Oh, not yeah, well, well. It's yeah, a controversial one as well, isn't it? Yeah, it, I think it's because of that whole yeah. kid situation. Yeah. Well, well, I win some, lose some, man. Look, it doesn't matter. We're still releasing bangers, so mm-hmm, mm-hmm. yeah. Do you think you know how you mentioned in the last podcast that like you guys obviously don't all the, the the ideas you do? If you take a video, it's not your idea; it's just the video you've been given. Yes. Do you think you guys should? Try and do that where you guys have an idea and let you run with it because I like, having like a top down approach to it. Well, no, be... we do like it is sometimes like for example, JJ might say let's do blind dating, but you do forfeits if you get chosen. For example, say that, yeah, sure. And we'll go, oh yeah, that sounds good. Someone might throw in something, but he came up with the idea. If he wants to take it, he'll take it yeah. and run with it. Yeah. So sometimes they do create the idea, but sometimes JJ will go, oh, let's do uh, winter holiday. Yeah. Or let's do fashion show or yeah. let's do box of lies and then someone else will take it. Yeah. So it's not their idea all the time. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Got you. That's the, Got you. that's, yeah. So it's kind of like a collective, like we all like chip in. Yeah. Um, I saw Deji in the Miami trip, little trip. He's got four months left on his bet with you where if he gets oh, yeah. a six pack, he gets Shit. a million well, you saw, pounds. You saw him on street, on your yeah, stream. Yeah. Yeah. Very sus. Way well, of revealing, by the yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Turned around, <laughs> chasing the camera. <laughs> uh, it's not looking good. But he told me that it, it only takes four months. So I was like, but it's been four months. It so knows, if yeah. it only takes four months, why are you not already Next done? month, he'll tell you it takes three months. Right. I told him to his face. I was like, I, t- I said to his face, and he got quite, uh, what? Like, you know, I said, there's no way you're going to do this. And I was like, the, re- the reason JJ has gone for a million is because he knows you're not going to be able to do this. And the mm. reason he's bet you one mil is that if you actually do it, then he'll be like, yeah, fair play. So try and teach you a lesson. Yeah. You know? But, but, he won't do it. Yeah, he won't. So no. if he doesn't do and it. And by the way, we've got we've got Vegas in the time frame <laughs> and he's there. Wow. So But I, no, I think Vegas would be good for him. In terms of yes, nah, he will. He's gonna wanna indulge. Eat, like, he'll indulge. No, yeah, yes, he like will crazy. indulge. But he's I gonna want to drink as well. But party. I think the others will drag him to the gym. But he hasn't got time by then. It's gonna be like a month. No, nah, he'll be hungry. Wait, over. what is it? When is it? June first. Uh I think June first. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's done. <laughs> So it's he's literally done. got the whole of April and the whole of May. Yeah, it's, it's, it's done. And he has to run down the Buckingham Palace. What is it called? The promenade. Yeah. In a mankini. Yep. Oh, so that's going to happen then. That's crazy. Cool. Yeah, I mean, I think he kind of low-key wants that to happen anyway. <laughs> he gets a banging video out of yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not a million pounds worth. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so the one thing we want to show you before we, we leave the podcast. We're I think uh, I think you're going to know this already, to be okay. honest, though. But the Dragon Ball Z theme park coming. Yes. You've seen it? Yes. You, I, you I, must be gassed, The amount right? of people who have sent it to me, it's phenomenal. You've seen this? Um, yeah, I, I mean, it's one of ones where I'm just going to we'll wait and see. Yeah, because it might be. You know those things where it's like expectation versus reality? Yeah. yeah. It might be like... <laughs> it, just, so, uh, I mean... It'll be like but, you queue two hours to hold a ball. Yeah, it could, <laughs> it could be really bad. So, I, for you example... Know right now. <laughs> For example, um, the Dragon Ball movie, yeah. like real life adaptation, yeah, like had so much hype and it was so fucking shit. Really? So like, it's one of the ones where I'll just wait, mm. see what mm. people are saying. If it's great, then I'll call, come through. Yeah. If it's like shocking, oh, that roller coaster. Then I, 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 I ain't doing shit. Is, like, so you know, there's Nintendo World with like Mario and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. that's that's not. I know, I know, Dragon Ball Z isn't human, but yeah. like. Mario is so unhuman. You obviously have like the mushrooms and all yeah, the blocks yeah, yeah. and everything like that. It looks weird. Mm. That kind of just looks like a city. Yeah. Like you've got like yeah. capsule houses. Yeah. yeah. To be fair, like, Piccolo, like, yes, there's a big dragon. Yeah. 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 Piccolo looks pretty normal, doesn't he? No, I think it's green. No, that's not that. Yeah. <laughs> I think it'd be cool if they were to do like, you know, like if I want to do a comment on my heart and make it look like I'm actually doing one or some shit like that. But that's just a green screen. like. Yeah, I don't, uh, yeah, well, I don't know. If they can just do some cool stuff, something to do with like a spirit bomb or something to do with like, I don't know, a Jiren or all these other characters, etc. He's lost. I, I, know, yeah. I know Jiren. W- w- who's Jiren? Little blue hair guy. What? Can you pull Jiren up? Let's see. 
blue haired guy. I, I, that's Belma. I think I think the I think I think of Bulma. Belma. Bulma. Bulma. That's not even oh my Oh Jiren, yeah, yeah, no. I actually don't know who he is. But I used to be a big Dragon Ball Z guy. Really? Massive, yeah, I used to collect the cards and everything. No way. Got some, got some cool I need cards. to watch more. I've I've seen him from the films. The latest yeah, yeah, films, yeah. but I haven't watched any of the series. Yeah. Is he in the film? Yeah, he was in uh the Broly film. Oh well I, no, I, I saw that then. The different one to that. Not the Broly film that we saw. He's in another one. Is he? No, he's, he's only, in a film because I've seen him and I've some, only watched. Someone's getting G check right not, now. You're, you're getting G check. He's only in a super in Dragon Ball Super. Is there a Dragon Ball Super film? No, I've seen this man. Movie, Broly. Oh shit! Boom! I've seen that film. <laughs> I went to your uh, screening. Fuck. Oh yeah. Okay, fair, fair. yeah. I don't remember him in in that. It's where uh, it's. I don't actually know. It's not just in a tournament at some point. Oh, it continues from Tournament of Power. Got it. Obviously. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, actually, I actually watched God. a little bit of yeah, uh, okay. Dragon Ball Super, then I stopped. You know? Yeah. Back in the various days, I was like, might as well watch what I'm singing about. I might watch it because uh, the reason I don't watch as much anime anymore is because I only watch it when I'm tired and I can't be bothered to watch subtitles. Yeah, but Dragon yeah. Ball, I'll watch dubbed. I've, uh, yeah. I'm getting some art made of the screen where you're, you're in like Jujutsu Kaisen and stuff. Yeah. Nice. But, um, I actually think it's better dubbed. <laughs> Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball, yeah. Like I've yeah. watched I've watched it, you know, subbed. And I don't know, it just like I don't like how Goku sounds and all of that. I I don't know. I feel like there's more emotion. Is in... that because you watched it as a kid dubbed? I yeah, think yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So Whereas, like, like a new anime, like Attack on Titan. Yeah, yeah, I watched that uh, subbed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Because you the voice you remember as a kid. Yeah, the, okay. You know? Yeah, fair. Just give you that before before you you offend all the fans there, you know. Yeah, very true, very true. <laughs> Yeah, I was gonna say, is that an opinion you think is gonna get you in a lot of trouble? Nah, <laughs> no, I think no, Dragon no. Ball's the acceptable one. Yeah, yeah. Cool but, people um, watch Dragon Ball. Obviously, a bit of a sad one, but Tori- yeah, Toriyama. Yeah, yep, Toriyama. Yeah, yeah. obviously, he passed away. Passed away. I feel like there's not many people, celebrity-wise, well, celebrity-wise, that you would actually have an effect on, like a yeah, proper, like, yeah, yeah. okay, this has really bummed me out. This one, well, I think I mentioned it somewhere. I think it was on Logan's podcast. I said that. I cried. Yeah. Like, yeah. I can't imagine many people like that would cause that reaction to you yeah. that you don't, aren't like friends with. Yeah. Like it's the first celebrity that I actually cried about because it was just, he was part of my childhood. Like he is one of the reasons I feel like I'm here today because of him, which is weird to say, but I just grew up on Dragon Ball and I still, I'm so obsessed about Dragon Ball. So, you know, with that person no longer in my life, it's like Dragon Ball isn't the same. Yeah, and he was still heavily involved, right? Yeah. So like do, you, do you he, think it's actually going to affect like? Well, the... he's, he's working. He was working on. Is it Dharma or the uh, Dragon Ball Dharma? It's it's where uh, all the uh, Dragon Ball characters are like small. Wait, talking about <laughs> Jeffrey. Oh <laughs> no, no, no! Or Super Saiyan Jeffrey. Nah, it's it D H A R. Oh D- yeah, Dima. Yeah. Dragon, okay. Dragon Ball Diamond. So he was working on that. And then uh then yeah, obviously, mm. you know. Yeah, rest in peace. But well, you actually like you model well, I not sure intentionally, but you you kinda you actually act like we always said you act like an uh, anime villain, you know. And every yeah. time every time he's like moaning in the FPL chat, I just put Vegeta crying. <laughs> <laughs> and when you walk out as well, the boxing, I feel like you walk out as if you're like uh, As if I'm a Dragon yeah, Ball character. Which is yeah. cool, that's cool, man. Yeah, yeah. Remember when you used to leave the cinema? I, I used to go watch Spider Man as a kid and you come out thinking you're him. You're yeah. actually yeah, you're <laughs> that shit, yeah. yeah, when you're a child. No, no, no. Well yeah, but like, you know, we keep that energy. <laughs> well, did you see um talking about Marvel, the Overwatch? Game. Yes. Uh, uh, have you seen the well, gameplay for it? Yeah, it looks a little clunky. Yeah. But it could be like development stages. I know? hope it is. Yeah, yeah. Development if it's little. not. But also, it's, it, do you think it's hard to like create a game that looks the same as like Valorant, Overwatch, but different enough? It's not even what it looks like. It's just it looks. It's how it looks like it feels. Okay, sure. To play, if like it, it looks if, very if clunky. it's exactly like Overwatch but Marvel, I'm a hundred. I'm sorry, Overwatch, but you're getting tossed to the yeah. side because of the like, characters. Hundred percent. Yeah. Of the characters. If you played uh, Marvel, Snap. like this, just looks very like. Ugh. Uh, yeah, uh, it looks good. Though. Stylistically, it looks kind of. Cool. It stylistically it looks phenomenal. The fact you can like destroy that is quite cool. Yeah, you can destroy like like buildings and shit. Yeah, but it still Even seems a little. No, but he's running. I think clunky. he's running like in the frames of the comic now, like the Into the Spider Web movie. 
Spider-Man. Uh, it just uh, it, it's a spider web. I'm so boomery. I'm gonna wait for reviews. I'm gonna wait for people wait for the to... actual game, full yeah, game yeah. to come out, and uh, yeah, decide then. Mm. But no, it looks good, uh, exciting, sweet, sweet. Well, um. We're getting towards the end of the podcast now. Oh. So if there's anything that you want to bring up or anything you want to mention, then go for it. Is there anything I want to bring up? <laughs> um, he bought his own t-shirt, by the way. Shout out to that. What? It's, it's not a stylist one. It's his own one. Damn. Well, I was with my stylist. Oh, well, you took it outside. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, still. <laughs> it still counts. I did buy it. Did, but did you say, does this look good? Um, and did she go, yes, JJ? <laughs> <laughs> no. I said I like this. She said it's awful, and he still got it. And I want it. <laughs> I love your style. It's so, no, so nice. Yeah. What? To be fair, I, I turned up to. I, it was something she was at. Yeah. And she looked at me, and she was like, "Oh, did you get a stylist?" Like, <laughs> I, gas I, me up. I think it's Simon wow. party. Huh? I think it was a Simon party. It might have been. She was there. Yeah. Yeah. Give me uh. a look. I did not have a stylist. So I was very. You kind of have a little stylist. I did not. What nope. Talia? No. Really? No. I thought she like just told you what to wear. No, it's more Mark. <laughs> yeah, got you. Well, he, Every now and then, he just buys me clothes. Isn't so. he a stylist? He is, but he just buys clothes sometimes, and he's like, "Do you want this?" Mm. Mm. But he does no. He doesn't. He doesn't dress <laughs> he me. He doesn't go. Clothes he doesn't go. Here's an outfit. Oh, sure. No. He just kind of goes like, "Oh, here's a nice hoodie. You should get this." Oh, okay. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> you just explain what stylist does? No, a stylist puts together outfits. Well, yeah, but they, they still have this. Okay, sure, sure. Clearly, you've never used one. I don't have. I, I, <laughs> I, I know. I don't have. Well, I swear you always wear that. No, 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 no. This is this is his oh, this second is one. one. This is oh. no. He does wear this, but there's one that he wears that's like black with white and red. Can we? Okay. What brand is it? Oh, it's it's my diesel. diesel. I'm yeah. sure if Can you we just get, type in Randolph, type in Randolph, and a hundred percent. No, it won't be. Like, no, go on his Instagram. First few images. My Instagram, yeah. But everyone, everyone on my vlog, they'll have a go at me for wearing that coat. But I bought that at your Tommy Fury fight, so it can't be that old. Uh, <laughs> you, you're literally, you're doing daily vlogs. So listen, 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 man. Listen, man. In, a, in a very sad thing, I actually don't live in my house anymore. So half my clothes yeah, in my house, yeah, half my house. Yeah, 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 yeah. This Shit, one. It's in three. Look, look. No. F- this, yeah. Three. Yeah, it is three. <laughs> you used to wear that orange one all the time. But I'm going to I'm gonna throw away my uh, whole wardrobe and buy some new stuff. Okay. Okay. We well, can go shopping. And you well, can vlog it. Yeah, but, but the shops you go in won't be the shops I go in. We can go to McDonald's. You know what? Maybe when we go to Vegas, <laughs> I won't take clothes. <laughs> no, <McDonald's>, what? <laughs> I just think the new McDonald's outfits. Uh, yeah, they, the, they go hard. The, 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 they go hard. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, no. They're just normal clothes. Oh. Everyone's like, how are you going to know who's working there? <laughs> Wait, no, but really? It's still branded. Very little, like. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, BA as well. BA got some new, new drip. I'm liking yeah. it. I'm liking this new revolution of new drip. Okay, we're going on a random tangent. Yeah, this is. This I'm is very really random. looking forward to Vegas. I am. Be- bro, I can't wait for the stories. Yeah. yeah I, I was saying, weird. like, I'm actually sad that it's getting closer because this whole year I've been like, oh, I can't wait for Vegas. And then when we go Vegas and come back, what am I going to look forward to? We don't actually have anything else this year. Like, last year yeah. we had two weddings and a stag yeah, do. Yeah, yeah. This Freeze year. was trying to get Ibiza going, but you shut him down. I don't know what Ibiza really. I don't know. I'd do Ibiza if we went like. To be fair, we, where did we go? For, was Vic's Ibiza? Yeah. No. Yeah. yeah. That was a sick. Uh, love trip. another house like that. Yeah, we need. Yeah, we need yeah, the yeah, house yeah. was my favorite part. It's, we yeah, need it, yeah. a boat and a hot tub. That's it. And a football pitch. A mini mini yeah, football sure, pitch. Yeah. Yeah. Or yeah. just a garden. Yeah. 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 Cool. Well, thanks for being the first guest on the new podcast. Oh, this pleasure. is also episode 250 as well. So, yeah. Oh, shit. Nice little yeah. round one. We did it on purpose. We sure. said we're going to quit at 1,000. Really? Yeah. But then you'll get to 1,000. We and made then... it to 1,000. Well, it's taken us five years to get to this point, right? So, like, that oh, means shit, 15 years 15 to get years. to 1,000. Yeah, I hope I don't know him in 15 years. <laughs> <laughs> Probably won't. I, I, I don't think I'm going to afford to be friends with you guys still. Costs quite a bit, man. All right. Well, um, thank you for coming on. No, as no, usual. You me, no. And hopefully you guys like the new set. Yeah, check out Prime as well, man. Love Prime. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Peace. Bye, bye, bye.